28 of the Jumper Punch. Welcome, Paolo, Marcello. How are you going? Hey, we got the disco lights going. Nice. Now, <laughs> let's, uh, let's now calm this down because I'm about to have a seizure here. <laughs> Mate, I was going to have a seizure at the game. Like, know. You know when every time the Bulldogs kick the goal, oh, oh, the little Marble chest, Stadium the was like, dimmed maybe, and then it was like... Maybe that's why they've closed the roof yeah, every time. Yeah, that's why. That's all the added the lights. effects. This a man. But they don't have a seizure warning, so what I'm going to do as a wog, I'm just going to put on an epileptic fit <laughs> and do compo. <laughs> do do compo. It's yeah. worth a try, eh? Yeah. It's worth a try, yeah. eh? It's worth a try, eh? I'm not a cop man like you. I love it. No, no, that's it, man. 
Nah, seriously, that's some of the worst. That's early banana, man, that one there already, man. That's actually Marvel Stadium. I'm stiff. It's a few, I'm stiff. a few answers, uh, a few questions to answer, man. I don't know about them. So, so that was a big game. Mamma mia. <laughs> oh, what a win. Oh, what's going on? I don't know. <laughs> Different. Never, yes, never. that's that's the new catchphrase. Different. For the year. They're different. 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 They're different. Yeah. It's the same, but different. The same team, but different. Yeah. It's strange, isn't it? It's strange. Four to five months, and it's just. It's strange. Look, I, I, you heard us last year. I never picked this. I never picked this. I. Well, how could you? You can't. Not off the back of you what know. we did last year, and the year before. You know. Well, that uh, is it. Just a, is it just a sign to show how incompetent our coaches? Were. were behind the scenes yep. like they must have been pretty bad <laughs> they, I know what no. was it he just got his accreditation <laughs> yeah well he no he's, he's coach uh, uh, level 4 he got it after he coached Carlton like that's grouse <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm pretty sure that that's what happened. But anyway, listen, that, they've put some good day. people in the right positions. <laughs> it seems at the moment. It seems at absolutely. The moment. And definitely the, well the coaching the is the, definitely the coaching is uh oh it just looks different. How exciting is it? Like oh. it's just that game on Thursday. Like that oh. second quarter. Oh, it's electrifying. 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 Hey, listen, I'm just uh, I sat through the game with excitement. But shock. Yeah. yeah. Like you're sitting yeah. there going, I'm going to like my son, Dylan. I'm going, did you, what, what's did just you happening? see that? What's happening? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then when they do a mistake, you go, what's wrong with them? Yeah. Like, like you're not expecting They're not allowed to make the mistake. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the wave of emotions. Oh, but it's sick. So you good. all watched it at the, at the, um, at the game. Now. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. It was scenes. Yeah. Mate, we, I'm, I think, I really think we outnumbered them. We got yeah. a lot, a lot, a lot of supporters oh. there. Oh, it was sick. And on the way yeah. out, it was oh. just like, like, like Cape's animals. It was animals. the best, man. It was that the singing at the oh, end. Oh, it yeah. was sick. Yeah, it was hey, gross. listen, there's a photo of me that someone took a photo of me watch it at the game, watching the game. Oh, yeah. did they? So oh, let's yeah. have a oh, I'll look at this one here. Schleifers. Oh, that's exactly how. Exactly what was happening that night there. I was enjoying a nice forty-five dollar beer there. Oh, watching right. it. That was Grouse. sick. Hey, you know who else got excited? Who? This man here. Yeah. Did you see him on fan cam? I did. Does he? He's such. He's does he to remind you of someone? Does this, what, <laughs> <laughs> Groucho, Groucho Marx. Marx. Far out, really he does too. The That's hair parted. I'm telling you, mate. Joey, we need to get you a big cigar. I am yeah. telling you, mate. Listen to me. He You're loving it. Hey, listen. This year. He's gone all in this year. Like oh, he's... Yeah. Hey, I just he... got... Listen, I just got it just before the show. Yeah. I got video of him. He's still partying. Is he? Have no. a look at this. He's still partying. <laughs> he probably dances like that too, man. 100% he dances like that. Yeah. Yeah. I think he was wearing the same suit on the fan. Yeah, he was too. As well. He was we too, Joey. mate. I'm telling you, listen, everyone's loving this. Everyone's loving it. Just and you know who was? Embrace it. No, embrace it. But you know, um, it was the first game this year that Walshy and Weedering won together this year. Because Walshy oh, well, just yeah, 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 yeah. Of yeah, course. Yeah, and they yeah. went out that night and they had a bit of a party that night. <laughs> Gonna ring for a holiday. I put your arms in the air, let me be the day. Gonna ring for a holiday. It's we're going to London and we are sitting on the Wikipedia Little Piece of Amsterdam. Right, we are going on a summer holiday. If you want to go to your swim, we're going to London and we are sitting on the Wikipedia Little Piece of Amsterdam. We're getting all this exclusive footage. Look at him, man. Look at the moves. That's everyone on Thursday. He doesn't just do the moves on the ground, man. They're like doing the moves everywhere. He came back in seamlessly. I know he probably didn't have the effect that would be cheesy. Four weeks you off of surgery. He got he got thirty odd possessions, correct? Thirty five, I think. Oh, and you didn't notice him. Oh. 
If you watch it, well, no. Yeah. I'm look. Usually, if he gets thirty four, you're giving him you're giving him five votes, right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm telling you, you didn't really notice yeah. him. And he had like nine or ten clangers too, mind you, right? If you have a look at the clangers, right? So, not that I'm blaming that it's his first game back, but but that's good. He's yeah, had yeah, 34 yeah, 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 yeah. and Room, you haven't yeah. noticed Room him. for improvement. And we've won. And he even he said that as well. Yeah. He said, you know, there were a few things, a few mistakes I made and which I've got to work on, got to get my touch back and stuff. So, which man. is always going to happen, but... No, no, no. You look good. Sure. Look you know good. who doesn't like it? Doesn't like what? Us winning. Who? The other people. Did you see the headline? No, what the was new, it? The news headline? What was it? Fans of 17 teams quickly realise. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Actually, I, I'm telling I, you. I, I haven't, we haven't put this in the run sheet, but I'm going to I'm gonna put it in a screenshot and you can put it up later. But one of my good mates who I went to uni with, it's a mad doggy supporter, Will Boddington. And <laughs> he, he sent me a picture. He sent me a message on the post I put up on Instagram saying, he goes, you Carlton supporters are loud psychopaths. Yeah, we are. <laughs> we are. We are. Sick. we are. They've all come here, man. I'm telling How you. good is it? You can just see, you can see the confidence in everyone. How, it's the, it's gonna... the Carlton arrogance, the strut. It's back. The property developers are back, like Mark oh, Robertson yeah. said. Yeah. I love it. Yeah. It's I amazing. love it. We are, mate. We are the biggest club. I don't care what anyone says. Collingwood, the drug cheats. Tigers, whatever you want, you can say whatever you want. We are the biggest club, man, and we've been sleeping. And you think like the Tigers went wild? No, I'm telling you, I don't. I do, and I don't want to see what's going to happen to Ligon Street. Yeah, if I know, something I know. Well, there. actually, Fav messaged me from the Ian Prendergast, and oh, he yeah. goes, "If you think that." Yeah. Like the Tigers come out, he goes, if when we come out, he goes, the Tigers will look like the Diamond Creek Footy Club or the Diamond <laughs> Valley Footy Club or something. That's right. Their social well, club. We'll give him a bit of shout out and just quietly, he he might be joining us in a, in a ah, yes. three or four weeks time or a so. couple of weeks time, whatever yeah. it is. But he did say before the season all started and that four and zero, he picked it early. So he's halfway there. We're not there yet. He's halfway there. He's on track. He's halfway there. One of the better products. Podcast, podcast yeah, there but too, Ian so. Prendercast yeah, as well. Yeah, definitely. Yep. Hey, listen, we need a coffee straight we up. We do, yes. Oh, God, I Let's forgot, do this we forgot about the coffees. Now, Mike, I'm assuming I'm going to have to, well, we'll yeah. find out if I have to go and get him. Let them know what the COVID protocols are. Yo, Goomba! How you going? Yes, go the blues. Of course, of course, of course. Of course we're going to beat them. The doggies, a bunch of rimbum beaters. Those people, <laughs> man, really. No chance, no chance. And this week... The Hawks, <laughs> those piss and shit coloured tops they wear. <laughs> Did you see that crap they wore last night? Gee. No, no, we'll get them. We'll get them. All right. Coffees. And you know what? I'm a little bit peckish. Everyone a bit peckish? Peckish. Yeah, All right. Yeah. Let's get the platter out. All right? Done. Thank you. A bit of gabagool. A bit gabagool. of gabagool. Over here. The gabagool. Do I have to get it? Gabagool. Yeah, yeah, nah, definitely have to right. get it, man. You know the protocols. Yep. Yeah, yeah. While we're hey, here, health and safety pay protocols. Pay me to go and pick Coffee up. is always Water brought cup. to us by... Melbourne. Copy. Copy. I'm still hungover from no, last night. No, we're still hungover. Copy from. Racing Co. Use Carlton 15 at the checkout for 15% off. Look yeah. at this. They're giving us a bloody Jesus. hamper. Look at this, eh? Hor cotillo. Mate, <laughs> manya, 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 fidu me. Oh, that's beautiful. How good is this? Yeah, yeah, so let you. me have another smell. Is it still there, the smell? <laughs> yeah. Is it still there? That's good, it's man. It's right. good. This thing will wake it. up in the morning. Love it. That's all you got to do. You just got to sniff it. And who else? Well, Merino Bros. So tell us about Merino Bros. What do we get with Merino well, Bros? We, we get the, the free shipping over $60. And it's uh, next day delivery if you order before 12 a.m. Ah, they were superb. Hey, yeah. and so we had another chat with them. Yeah, Later this on. week, man. Yeah. Oh. Old mate back? Yeah, yeah. he's back, man. He had a chat <laughs> with him, man. He's got such stories, man. He's lying, got, mate. He's got such stories. Uh, while we're here, before we have a drink, everyone check out the merch. Yes, yes. check out the merch. Right, check out the merch. So we got them. So they should definitely be up this week. They'll yep. definitely Fine. be there. Definitely. So I want you, yep. everyone, look at them. Also, go to our YouTube channel now. Yes. Go to the YouTube it was channel. Huge last The week. jumper pass. Last week it went from like 50 odd, we're up to nearly 170. Beautiful. Now we need Great to hit. Work. If we don't get it 
if we don't get it by the time of recording, which we might, but I reckon two fifty by the end of this episode. We want two fifty. We want two fifty. And also, Come on. just go across. Come on. Do it. Just subscribe. On, just, just, and watch links, the video. Just, the links just, are down get below. Get the little mouse. Just get your little They're mouse. All down below. Yeah. And all the yeah. links. Just get your little 100%. mouse. And all the links are down below. Click 100%. subscribe. Click. Hit subscribe and um, like, comment, watch the videos. The arm field went off. Yeah, yeah I just did it. Arm How good was it? The moment of him and Scott. Back to the sign, Scotto. Scotto Enterprises. Scotland Enterprises. Yep. Scotland yeah. Enterprises. Make sure you get out there. He's the man, you, and he'll come out and fit it for you. So you get to meet the man too. And also, so check out, subscribe. Um, next week, we're going to Wait. announce. Well, well, if you do that, right? You go into the prize for this. You go into the draw for the buzz poster. The buzz poster. Yeah. Merch and everything. So subscribe. Hand signed as well. Hand. Yep. Hand signed. signed. Yep. By Hand the buzz. Side, by Hand the buzz. signed by the buzz. Yep. And plus, there's going to be merch and all that. It's going to be a huge prize. So everyone, do that. Subscribe, like, bada bing, bada boom. Also, we're on Spotify now. Yes, yes we, are. we are on Spotify. You can listen on your drive home. So <laughs> drive home. We're going to on the work. When there's about 8 million hours of traffic. <laughs> exactly. Monash yep. Freeway. The Monash Car Park. park. Yep. And listen to Paul's call over and over and over and over again. Over and over again. Just rinse, repeat. Uh, so definitely. And we'll slowly be catching up to Joe Rogan, I think. Oh, yeah. Rate, so. Yep. Wow. <laughs> when, just Number quietly, one in I, Oz. No, no. Well, I saw um, it went up on Spotify and on my one because it's got my, you know, my favourite. Yeah, recommended yeah, so stuff, I got, yeah. I had like uh, Jumper Punch and Joe Rogan, yeah. right? Joe Rogan went for like two hours, 20 minutes yeah. and Jumper Punch two hours, 30 minutes. <laughs> 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 so we, we're beating him in time. I don't know about the bloody We've got more to talk about than him. We've got subscribers. So... Let's let's have straight away this the Medellin or is this the hot one from last nah, week? Like the, the same man is going to the grappa, yeah. It's good, yeah, man. Like That's so that was man. Luck. It's good, man. Look, at least I don't have to. A club, hey, at least I don't club. have to eat an apple this <laughs> week. <laughs> yeah, no, no, that was that was another that big, was bad. Big big session. Last that was week. an avergonia. That just quietly, <laughs> this is seriously. 35 year old grappa. No, I been brewing. Yeah, That's grouse. Warm the Robbie Cockerels. Warm the Robbie Cockerels. Oh, the way. Carlton. Cheers. The Blue Baggers. Please. And these cups proudly uh, oh, yeah. purchased by uh, the First Lady. Yes, of the, uh, Taylor, of the thank you for purchasing. Again. And Dylan, they both purchased these these cups for us. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. Fuck, that's good. Oh, yeah, man. We're going to have a nice spread here. Mm. That'll get it going. Oh, that's... Wow. That is absolutely. I'm telling you. That's tech. That's. That's giving <laughs> yeah, me. You have to do the what? Yeah. <laughs> I might have to take. That's a bit weak from you. I might have to take a bit of them so because much, it's. They? Or give me the brujol. Hey, listen. We've gone to. Uh, yeah. Let's uh, have a little bit, look some more vision. You need to just relax, huh? No, because I reckon we've still got some vision of, uh, right. of Joe here. Let's have a look okay. at Let's have a look at him. <laughs> 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 He's got the table. We're freaking out. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this is live footage too, guys. This from is live Sydney. footage. Yeah. From He's Sydney. got the table, mate. Look at it. <laughs> he's loving it mate he's live footage hey, you know what we'll do through the night we'll keep going back oh. because we've got <laughs> live, live footage of him man. Right. He, he hasn't stopped we'll partying hey this week one sec this doors oh, I'm doing the same thing there we go this week we are episode 28 we are episode oh, 28 doing alright doing alright yeah, well, it's, well a bunch it's, of... it's 27 more than I thought I would have hung yeah. on for but anyway wow <laughs> Terry thought there was going to be a new show after episode two. But anyway, so we got to 28. Wrong, he thought wrong, mate. Hey, listen, we're going to put up this photo. Let's put up this photo, and I want you to tell me who this is. That's Heath Buck. That's Heath Buck. Yeah. <laughs> 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 hey, Heath Buck, 86 to 87, <laughs> under 19, 32 games. What was he, number 20? 28. Was he 28. number 28? <laughs> oh, Bucky. Go, Bucky. 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 <laughs> <laughs> love the buck, love, 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 love. Hey, hey, put up this other photo, and everyone have a look at this. This is him on the team sheet there. And if you look closely at 28. Hey, there you go. Buck. Who's Greg Buck? Any relation? Maybe now, his brother? 
his brother did play for the under 19s. I don't know if they played together, but it might be. Fast. Ian Aitken's in there. I think it is. I think it is. His brother did might play be. for the under 19s. Oh, also. We'll have to, it's got to be. be. So that's a, that's a spin here. A couple of wogs there. Yeah, so, yeah, 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 yeah. Angelo, Phillip, If you could see, he signed. So if, you go, yeah. if we go to the next photo, have a look at this, right? This is his actual contract. Oh, wow. So in there it says, Amazing. signed a contract in 86, $30 for a win, <laughs> $15 for a loss, and $80 if he got a game in the twos. Oh, wow. There you go. That was in 86. That's there amazing. You go. Far out. Now, that's that's a awesome. Of grand to play a game. Yeah. yeah. Now even the dead shits. Yeah. 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 <laughs> the dead shit will get a couple of grand to play a game. Yeah, Look great. at this, man. That's uh, good stuff. That's right amazing. Here, Fantastic. But now, Bucky, if you know. Yes. No, of course we know him. But yeah. what I'm saying is, <laughs> he was, he was vice captain the premiership with the Hammerheads. Yeah. For the Channel Seven reality TV show. And here is the post. How oh, good oh was this show? God. This yeah, show yeah, was yeah, the yeah, best. Yeah, what yeah. Slam and Sam kick yeah, a bitch. Just, yeah. yeah. I didn't know. Eat, your, eat your lamb. Yeah. Eat your lamb. <laughs> Get into your lamb. I did um. I didn't know Heath Buck at the time, so I didn't like realize like he was the playing the, uh, those days so but there you go didn't so. they win the they won the grand final the, yeah. the one and only year they won Who the was grand that, final that Reese Jones was their Reece coach Reese Jones Reese Jones was the coach yeah yeah 100% That's man fantastic. yeah the hammerheads I actually watched every episode of that I was like enthralled by it man so that was and us. they had um, one of the they had a they had a lady on their team as well didn't they I think you're right. I'm certain they did because she was one of the stalwarts for like women's footy. I can't yeah. remember her name. Anyway, but that's one for another day. But I'm certain they had a lady on their team. So. Good on them. And not there that I've got to tell everyone this, but he is the host of My, my Blue Heaven. Heaven. No. Seriously, the OG. One of. One of. Definitely. Man, he's been doing it for years, yeah. man. And one of the best, man. I'm I, loved, you. I loved his preview. Of the Carlton Bulldogs game. Did you see what he did? With the, on his with, preview? With the little turtle? With the turtle. Oh, the little turtle. The turtle. Yeah, this, this, is how I want, yeah, <laughs> this is how I want him to... <laughs> mate, snap. dedicate... What's the turtle's name? Constantine? Yeah. yeah, yeah Constantine. Yeah. Dedicate the episode to Constantine. He was going a little bit crazy because he was stuck in that room. For yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> with the one on, like, one on his laptop, look. on his car, then he's just looking straight up. He's better now, though. The family, like... Just they shunned him. They shunned him in the back. <laughs> Poor Bucky. Uh, that, that's the Australian. In the Wog family, yeah. the family would have been in there. Yeah. <laughs> and your man would have been in the house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, so he was a great... Oh, listen, we always say if you could play one game, look, he made it to... Fuck, to, I love Bucky. No, <laughs> I love him. I love him. He's the, the, the previews and the reviews. He's I, just so I good. need to he's watch so him, good. man. All right, so we did have another great one. So this is the record holder, and this bloke here, let's have a look at a picture of him, Percy Jones. Yep. Hey, 66 to 79. Now, 249 games, 284 goals. He was a bit of a clown sometimes, right? But <laughs> he was. Plenty but those, the four-time premiership player, 68, 70, 72, 79, best and fairest in 73, and senior coach in 1980, and the Carlton Hall of Fame. Mm -hmm. All right? This bloke here... Lit could play so we'll, we'll put up some highlights while we're talking and about these him. highlights we're actually going to see him yeah, <laughs> no. yeah there's no look, look at him when he was young man not running around in behind look at him i'm telling you he was a he was a fair player mate Courageous. he was a fair player so you, if you watch this and this is him winning i think the first premiership that's amazing look at him, but this is what we know him for look at him look at this look at this <laughs> look at the way he used to get excited mate i love him man Look at this, and this is one of my favourite bits of footage. What's this? <laughs> he just he can't <laughs> take the decision. You know that would have been. It's like a non or now. like that. Fifty metre penalty. Oh mate. yeah, can't do that now. Can't do that. Look at this. Look at this. What? Well, <laughs> 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 that's love that's an eight hundred metre penalty. Yeah, right no, there. that's it. That's it. Look at him. <laughs> hey, Jesse, Jesse, just grab the ball and give it back. Come on, Percy, <laughs> Mink, are they? Come on. He was a star, man. I'm Hard on his sleeve. Look at that. Yeah, yeah no, no. Look at yeah, this yeah, you're crazy, you're mate. crazy, mate. You're crazy. It's a big, big boy. He was a big, big, boy. big, big. Look at him, buddy. <laughs> Look at this. You used, used to love it when someone else used to kick a goal. Look. Yeah. <laughs> what a character. Look at him. 
Look but at him, Salas Marku. Yeah. You little mongrel Marku. But this is one of his most Look famous. This really almost cool. reminded me of Peter Nett last week. Watch this. <laughs> <laughs> but here he is. This is his last game for Carlton. 249 games holding up the 79 Premiership Cup. So he was a fair player. In the 1980, he became the senior coach after Jezza resigned. Mm -hmm. Why did he resign? Do you remember? Was there something to do with the pay dispute? No. George Harris lost the presidency to Ian Rice, and he was never happy about that. So he left and he went to St Kilda. In that year uh, that that, uh, Percy took over, they made the finals but bowed out. Yeah, straight right. sets straight away you know and they finished like second on the ladder or something so they did really right. really well you know but one of the quarter times against Richmond in one of the finals I think it was the first final he got into a fight a quarter time with coach Tony Jewell and the psychologist <laughs> Dr. Rudy Webster in the in the in, have a look at this in the in the Tigers huddle the so, Tigers huddle he got yeah, in a fight look he got it look at it <laughs> he's ready to rock and roll look at this he, they actually got into a fista Throw fista it. cups throwing a few few hands look at this look at this they had to hold him back how's man. the flares look at he's got the flare pants on too a few lunch boxes sensational so there you go there's a there's a Percy man icon. one of the greats he is one of the icons as I said four premiers here so and look he character yes good play character and war the heart of the sleeve, mate. Yep. That's what you want, man. Correct. He loved it. He you need players it. like that in your team. Yeah. Always. 100%. All right. Our feature this week. Now, this year, we're going to get a player. He only played 62 games and 56. Why are you going to get this bloke? Right? Well. Because he had the best name ever. ever. And, and the, the greatest name? Huh? Probably one of them. I think it's one of the one longest of. names. I don't Could know. Be. One His of name was Spiro. Corkamillus. Corkamillus. Spiro Corkamillus. And he was a bit of an icon, man. Yeah. So let's have a look at this interview with him. All right. And here we have him, number 28, Spiro Corkamillus. Is that the way you say it? Yeah, no, that's pretty well right, Robert. Yeah, <laughs> welcome to the jump. No worries. Pleasure to be here, And mate. number 28, 62 games. 56 goals for going, is that correct? That's correct. Should have been a few more, mate. Should have been a few more goals? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How'd you get to come? Uh, local kid just around the corner, mate. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. About 15 years old, sort of, yeah, sort of hanging around the streets and stuff, and was able to get a few kicks. My yeah. old man didn't let me go and play footy, but uh, I used to sneak out and go and play for the local team, Princess Hill. Yeah, yeah. So about 13 years old and stuff. Had to spend a couple of years there, and then Carlton sort of noticed me, picked yeah. me up, and I was down there when I was 15. There's a few players I noticed yeah. that, their, that their parents wouldn't let them play football those days, yeah? The, the wild parents, they were... Greek background, mate, you know, <laughs> so it was like I needed to play soccer or, you know, yeah. you know, and that was okay, but, you know, football was, you know, for the long hair, the yeah, louts yeah, and stuff yeah. like that, no, and, no, you know, no. you weren't meant to sort of go. No. But uh, once we, you know, got got there and played and stuff, the old man never missed a game. Yeah. Right? So he was there every week. Yeah, so. he loved it. Yeah. Were you a Carlton supporter? No, I wasn't, mate. I was a Collingwood supporter, I must say. I used to like anyway. I used to like Peter McKenna. Oh yeah, yeah. Peter McKenna. But that soon changed, mate. Yeah, yeah Carlton supporter through and through now. Yeah, and, no, that's it. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Hey, when you played between eighty one and eighty six, mm-hmm. you played with some great players, huh? I'm gonna name a few. Armstrong. Uh, Buckley, Glasgow, Harms, Sheldon, Johnson, Wells, Mark Hoo. Yeah, yeah. It was hard to break into that middle, huh? Oh, yeah. It was like, look, I mean, we had an amazing side. You know, the 79, uh, you know, won the grand final 79, missed out 80, probably should have won, finished on top, 81, 82. Amazing yeah. sides. Yeah. I mean, look, I mean, I was only a kid coming through yeah. in, in those sort of early, early 80s, but, uh, you know, some of the people, I remember running onto the ground, and, and my first game, Next to me was Robin Flower, for an example, right? So oh, yeah. there's another great, yeah, you know. Like yeah, I mean, yeah, I, yeah. I stood there on th- in awe of this dude, yeah. and then you, you know, on, the, on our halfback flank, there's Hunter, there's Harms, there's Dool, Southby, these sort of bikes, which 
you know, I've, yeah, a lot of the younger people these days and stuff like that, we don't know how good nah, how yeah, good yeah. the uh, the Blues were in those yeah, days. Yeah, they were tough, mate. We used to walk around with their chest out there. Mate. You know, it was the pl- place to be and the yeah. club to be. You know, both on the ground and off the ground, boys. Yeah, yeah? 100%, so that's the way it was. Man. Yeah. Hey, the first game was in round 17, 1981. Yeah. You're 17 years old. That's right. Can't imagine that these days, huh? First of all, they don't get recruited till they're 18, but 17, and you're. You were playing with these blokes here, man. Some harder men, mate. They were going to run through you if they had to, yeah? Oh, they did, you know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was my first game. It was. I, I kicked the goal for my first game. Now, I was going to say, it was, you were you're in that you in that elite group, people yeah. group, yeah? First goal, first yeah, kick. Yeah, yeah, do you remember the goal? I do. Kenny Hunter handballed over the top. It was an amazing goal. You know, I was in the goal square and just booted it out five metres out. <laughs> <laughs> it was one of those ones, right? So, uh, yeah. All right, Spiro Corkamillis. Telling you, watch the rest of the interview so everyone get on to the jumper punch. Jumper punch. Yeah, and watch page, the rest of you, you're going to like it, man. I'm telling you, man. And there's the other videos there, and I'm telling you, these are just worthwhile, man. This bloke, I'm telling you, he was an icon. Him and Vinny Cotoggio. <laughs> I'm telling you, like, they didn't play a lot of games, but they were just like. What in- was Vinny Cotoggio's nickname? Cat? The cat. cat that's yeah, right, the yeah. cat. Yeah, 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 that's yeah. right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The cat. Why spinner? Because he could spin out a contest. They used to call him okay. Spinner. Cat. Yeah, yeah. That's right, the cat. Yeah. And the bloke, I'm telling you now, hopefully one day we'll get a, we'll get to talk to him. I have spoken to him. The bloke, he had a good time when he was young. Yeah. <laughs> he was, I'm he sure was he an did. iconic man. Yeah, With I'm the sure hair he and that, he was yeah. iconic 100%. man. So, so yeah, that was uh, good. Hey, listen, I just got word. Let's just... Have a look at uh, what Joe's up oh, to. Live cross again down to yeah. Sydney. There we go. Nobody hey, 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 he's jumping up on the table. Oh, still oh, going. Oh, no. <laughs> look at this. I think you can see September. He's just like, <laughs> hey, like they're jumping up and down. Yeah, that's who's that? that? Daniel. <laughs> <laughs> that's <what I> <laughs> Daniel's next to him. He oh, almost loving it, loving it, loving it, loving it. Hey, listen. Why are we here? Because we're here for. We're here because we won another game. Game. Two in well, a row. We would have been here if we lost one too. That's true. Yeah. <laughs> but let's have a look at the score. This was Carlton. 16-6-102. That's two weeks in a back row. Back in the in the official they were kicked a hundred. Uh Western Bulldogs 13-12 at 90. As you can see, the goals five to Kerno, four to McCabe, two to Krima, two to Sauce. Kennedy, Owies, Fisher, one. Now, I just want to give some stats here again on the mids, right? Yes. Cripps, 35 and one. Walsh, 34 and zero. Hewitt, 32 and zero. Kennedy, 30, 31 and one. These are goals when I say one. Yeah. Oh, my God. About 140 between them. Oh, my God. That's two again, weeks in a row. The they Avengers. are just killing it. Now, I just want to show you this picture here of... Six million dollars. Six million dollars. Six million dollars. Twenty-three. Contested. Uh, contested eleven clearances and two goals. The bloke. Look at him, mate. The bull's back. The bull's back, man. Yeah, what a back. performance. Fuck. And um, I think that goes a long way to where we are at the moment. The barometer. He is. He's the barometer. He is, man. He's killing it. He's yeah, leading the, the uh, front. 22 and zip. I mean, two and zips looking. 22 and zips. <laughs> well, I'm looking at it. <laughs> Sorry, oh, I was it. It's pretty hard, Freudian man. sleep. Far I'm, out. That's, uh, is, I'm looking at the ball joke? now. Okay. I reckon our next challenge might be Sydney in round like Relax, 10. relax. Next week, next week, it's just relax. Yeah, actually, we'll talk about just that relax. coming up. We'll talk about coming what, up. How, like, I just can't believe, not I can't believe it, because I think we always had an inkling that there was something under the bonnet that just needed to be oiled up and, yeah. you know, released, really. And now we've seen it, and it's just... It's still amazing that it's been released. Watch. Well, it just goes to show you, and we said it too, like, uh, the coaches must have been deplorable. The inept. They yeah. shouldn't be coaches. No. Listen, we, we have to admit, it's not just coaches... The administration that must have been pretty because oh, it yeah. all starts well, they from there. Them. Look yeah. at this fly they picked now. the coaches. Oh shit! How do you get a fly? In there? Look at this fly. How do we get a fly in there? Oh, look at him. Check him out. The, the whole organisation just because really, if the coaches are 
not doing their job, aren't the people on top going, like, what's going on here? This fly. <laughs> That's right. Do you? So you get the Mortine? You got Mortine? Okay, I'll get the Mortine. I'm going to cool Well, as you used to put it, a minestra of merda. <laughs> That's what it was. That's what it was. It was. It was. Yeah. It was. And now it's just kind of all fitting together, so it's really nice. You know what? Before we go into the game, let's go to our favourite. Oh, yeah. I think it's become one of our favourite segments. We might have to change Well, it is that, the same shit every well, week. It we're is, winning. It's a good thing. We're winning. Same thing. That's it. <laughs> Clap them off. <laughs> See what? It can mean See? anything. See? Exactly. <laughs> Clap them off. Same Maybe shit. I was cheering them off. Yeah, that's right. That's however that's you right. interpret it. That's right. That's right. So we got the big journal this week. All right, let's do it. How man. big is it? This one is a long one. It's Jesus yeah, Christ. It's a long one. Nah, the second said, quarter. I just... love this because now I can eat something. Yeah. All right. Well, the second quarter is a I'm beauty. I'm just going to close the book. <laughs> yeah. You don't need the book. I'm get, just going to close out. Get your auntie pasta. Maybe you're eating a pie. These shepherd's olives, pie. I'm telling you, man. Maybe you're having a little cafe. Mate, yeah. gear up. Let's go. Gear up. First quarter. Can we rectify last year's heartbreak and go two and zip for the first time in a decade? Oh, boy. <laughs> While she's back, baby. Oh. Umpire bounces the pill like Lipitor does on a Saturday night. <laughs> 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 Crips the Walsh. I can't wait for this all year. Turno snaps and goals inside 15 seconds, just like me last time in bed. <laughs> We've picked up where we've left off with high pressure. The accountant, Tim English, absolutely hooks on for no score. He's back, the accountant, with a second bite of the cherry, and he sneaks it through, six yeah. plays six. He fucking got up and about when he was yeah, cheering. Far no, no. out. Ah, Doherty gets the kick smothered. Just kick a first time. Dogs hit us on the rebound and find me as X, the hyphen, Hugel Hagen. He snaps a goal, 12-6. Oh, to six. <laughs> well done, Doherty. Makes up for the drop mark. The sausage gets a goal on the rebound over the back. That's a cheat goal, but we'll take it. 12 plays 12. We don't get enough of them. Exactly. We've been starting to, though. The Wilson's car park. Kennedy with a beautiful crumb and snap. 12 plays 19. He's built like a car park. One of our mates put it. Yeah. He's like, he's built like a car park. Yeah, he's huge. This midfield is like a well-oiled Rolls Royce. Mackay receives a driven park. Park. See? It's still Pass. in my head. Pass. Snaps around the body and nails it 12 to 25. We didn't miss, did we? Blues are up and about here. Mackay with a quick release of Kerno and handballs it like a nonce. The one where he handballed it, but he didn't put enough yeah, juice no, on no, it. No, no, no. He's trying to get the fly. you got to come in behind <laughs> no, it. I did. Yeah. <laughs> nonce. That's a nice running goal by Trello. The ass jiggles 18 to <laughs> <place> 25. <laughs> It was, dude. It was, dude. The arch eagle, he it. That's it. Crippen Thakya with a shankada of a kick. The one, and then he got Bush and he got a free kick. Yeah. Uh, ball, dickhead. Kripadis <laughs> goes back and drives it through the eye. Diddle, diddle. 18 plays 31. Cripps head clash with Charlie and all you see is Claret bleeding like Scarlet from the Mortal Kombat. So yeah. if you play games, Scarlet, she's the, she's the beholder of blood. <laughs> that was him. <laughs> Who's this little gremlin Scott carved us up like a Sunday roast there? Twenty-four plays thirty-two yep. just before quarter time was a goal where English went to McRae and then he just chiseled yeah, one. Yeah. It was actually a nice goal. Second quarter underway. Kripadi is like a Roman warrior with a headband. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> when he strolled out of the thing, I was like, oh, oh, oh yeah. Oh, Everyone oh, cheered, man. Oh, yeah. They loved it. Yeah, it was unreal. It was a good... Oh my god, the plays by the Blues off the, off the throne is infectious. Quick hands in close, finds Cripps and he scores another. Actually, I screamed that out there. Yeah. I was going, boom, 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 boom. <laughs> this is like sex right now. Twenty five plays thirty nine. Might as well call this the journal featuring Cripps. <laughs> Nakai marks inside 50. He'll start at left goalpost and bend it back, Chicha. Bang! 25 oh, plays 45. I love when he does that. That's oh. just, it's just routine for him. Yeah. People go, oh, Gita. nah. Routine. Gita, Gita. Gita Mondo. <laughs> the centre bounces are too easy at this point in time. Fire out, sound like Joe. This <laughs> midfield is serious now. The king. Free kick. John Cena always takes advantage. Yeah. Snaps one home. 
25 plays 51. Fucking stop it, Crippen that guy. Yeah. Bull, bull. <laughs> Kerno snaps again on his left. That ball has hit the Balti Bridge. 25 plays oh, 57. He just pounded well, it on I'm the done. boot. Fuck, wasn't he up and about? Unlucky Hugo Hagen. How's Mia going, mate? <laughs> Unlucky. <laughs> Uh, oh, piss make. off, Ump, again. If that's getting paid, Mackay gets 10 a week. Yeah. Uh, it was the one on Norden. Where, oh, where we the ring, oh. they were just challenging for the ball. Disgusting. <laughs> this fraud, the astronaut, gets his charity 32, plays 57. While starting to get a bit of it now. The run and carry off halfback is unreal. Kerno to Mackay and the Twin Towers 2.0 combined. Harry Coleman goes back and kicks it up shit creek. 32 plays 63. Smart from Silvani over the top, tap to Cripps again. Fisher oh, yeah. gets on the end of the chain. He'll go back and kick a ball. Oh, and he yeah. does. And he does. 33 to 69. But it wasn't a 10 9 69 lemon chicken. It wasn't chicken. a lemon chicken. No. Nah. Not quite. What, 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 what am I watching? It was dinner for two. What am I watching here? <laughs> the pill popper Libertore finishes with a classy goal on the left. <laughs> 39 plays 69. Manic pressure here from the Carlton. Oh my God, is that Fabio Grosso or Lockie O'Brien? <laughs> <laughs> he could get a week for that, low key. Just low key. Grosso Great dive. Gaccia di rigore, gaccia di rigore, gaccia di rigore, gaccia di rigore. <laughs> gaccia di rigore. <laughs> Great dive and poetic justice, he hits the post. This bloody fly! Anyway, Damn it. flies. <laughs> Sorry. Don't forget to The best regard. hands in the game has risen. Harry Coleman Mackay, a carbon copy, four straight, three nine set. 39 to 76. Oh my God, Creeper, stop it. He floors Rourke Smith, that little dead shit. <laughs> you can't touch Walsh like that. Crack him. <laughs> I was going, I, was, I got up and put yeah, him in the wall or something. Oh, I got something he, to he say went, about that, yeah. He smashed, he smashed Walsh into the yeah, floor. Pitch comes over. I love it. Who are you, I mate? I something to say about that. Like. Handing up like a Jack Russell, great mark, and he gets his goal for the multi. What a second quarter. This has been electric. Third quarter. Bulldogs start the score strong. Mia Hagen rams it through for a behind. Some nice play off the half forward for the kennel. Bailey Dale lands one from 50, 52 to 76, and here they come. Bulldog going into another gear here. The surfboard waxer sprays it. That's Cody Waitman. Yeah. <laughs> the surfboard waxer. Wax <laughs> Zach Balenciaga Williams hitting more targets than Clint Eastwood in a dirty area. <laughs> <laughs> No, 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 umpire. He stopped and stood there. That's not 50. It was when Mackay, he told him to stop and he just stood there like, like a scarecrow and yeah. he paid the 50. Here he is again, the surfboard, the surfer. Wobbles one home. Like him on a surfboard at Bells Beach. Why isn't the Aldi wine on the line? If he was standing on the line, he would have tapped know, it through. That's right. That's right. 100%. Under 10s type shit there. You were fantastic to the sausage, strong mark, he fires it home and gets the quick reply. We've had done a lot of that. that. Had to kick that. We did that last week as well, where yeah. we got the quick reply. It's usually what teams do to us, we're doing to, to them. That. But That's that was a... Great mark. Great mark. Man. And to it was finish hip, off. Uh, Hewitt and O'Brien in the middle. Good hips by O'Brien as well there. Beautiful. Bang! What a hit on Vandermeer by McGovern. Stay down, you little shit. <laughs> <laughs> I Pil love that. I like good. that. Of course, it's man. good. Good, it's good. That's a bit of the boss influence there. Pill Popper drills it through like he does a revolver. Sixty-four plays eighty-three. Plowman is on. Oh, oh my, my god. god! Oh yeah. Oh god. Jeremy McGovern. Oh shit. I mean Mitch. M Mitch <laughs> two point eight mil McGovern flies from the side. Massive mark. Ah, oh, that was in the back pocket. That was actually. Yeah. And was that a critical time? Critical time. Where did he come from? He was never no, in like, that contest. Nah, it was, he just flew in. Toast and started. Yeah, just dropped from the sky. That was sick. just dropped from the sky. That was, that was sky. superb. Superb. This superb. Scott Worm again. He he scores his second. Back to thirteen points. Seven. He plays 83. Hopefully no apple crumble. What a bullet handball by Silvani. Always gets it to ground. Charlie crumbs and converts a massive goal. 71 plays 89. The 40 year old version claws up Richards. Ball gone. Oh, what a dickhead. tackle. How From good was that? Big tackle as well. Because yeah. they were starting to go yeah, again. But he was smart when he did it. He corralled him and then bang. That was very beautiful. Good. There was been some smart decisions. Hey, right mate. Hey, Brian. Fourth quarter, a nail biter incoming. Needs Cripper here to lift because he kind of went quite in that third. 
mean, he lost a bit of blood. <laughs> so no, he's running right a little bit. True, true, true. true. <laughs> Oh my God, Plowman misjudging that spoils on the outer wing, ah, the member side. And he, he, he ball went out. Everywhere. They cladded yeah, everywhere. Yeah, there was yeah. just bodies everywhere. And here's the bond sitting at the back. He kicks it through. The fire starter back to two goals. Just an arm wrestle here at the moment. Turnover after turnover from both teams. Just going like this. It's like ping a ping pong, pong t- game. It's like a freeway up and down, up yeah. and down, up and down. Free kick, Charlie. Paul reckons 100 to 1 from here. You know what? I'll take it. And back him in. Let the vision do the talking. Mm. Bang! <laughs> goal. Seventy-seven plays ninety-five, mate. Just, just quiet. What a fucking goal. That was. Yeah. I'm telling what you, those goal. goals, crunch goals, every single time. Just absorbing the doggy's best shot here. Oh my God, Hannon! The left foot snap from the boundary. How has he kicked that? Tinas. Ah, oh. <laughs> he just slammed it on. How Tinas. the hell did he kick that? Tinas. Now I've actually got. I'm going to put a photo up. This is impromptu, and I'm going to put it. When, I think O'Brien touched it on the line. Okay, yeah, right? yeah, yeah. Now, is the goal flag, the, uh, the umpire's flag, is that part of the post? Yeah. It well, is, if isn't it, it? If, it hits the po- if it hits the goal flag, yeah, it's a it's, point. Okay, so I've, got a, I've done my <laughs> little, just a straight line down, and the edge of the ball from when he touches it, he's hitting the goal flag. Is it? Yeah, the goal umpire's well, flag. Well, let's get Is the Have goal flag? Part part well, it is post. because okay. if it hits the goal umpire's okay. flag, it's a behind because okay. it's happened before. Okay. Have you got? Yeah. Have you? Yeah. All oh, right, we're going to put that go. up. Yeah. We're going to do the investigation. This yeah. is PPI. The Colombo <laughs> file. The Colombo <laughs> file. See the Colombo. <laughs> <laughs> Just one more question. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Yeah. Walsh from the centre, that's too easy. Charlie goes back and sends the message straight back to the doggies. It just feels different. It it's just different. Trello misses to the right from uh, 50. Repeat entries here from the Bulldogs, like a 70-year-old Greek from Oakley <laughs> into the tab. Repeat <laughs> 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 entries. <laughs> and they were getting no paying tickets no, either. No paying tickets, this mate. ticket is, is not a winning <laughs> ticket. This is not a winning ticket. This is not a winning ticket. Nil pay, nil pay. Norton misses 86 to 101. McCrader Dunkley also for 87 to 101. The kicking here is nervy as fuck. <laughs> oh my God, O'Brien on the full. Oh, About man, time Mackay got a holding. The Christmas tree, the ornaments are hanging off him. Absorbing the pressure like a, a sham wow. <laughs> <laughs> sham wow. <laughs> yeah, wow. We're home, baby. We're two and zip. <laughs> and that'll Love be it. the journal. It's a long one. That is so good, man. Bravo, 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 bravo. That was <laughs> sick, man. What a game, though. Oh. I don't know what There's something about. happening There's here. Much, there is something happening, man. I don't know what's going on, but I'm telling you, the way they're playing, the confidence... It's everything we've been calling for for the last God knows how long. Yeah. Go out there. Play with the brand. Play with honour for the Guernsey. Play for your but, mates. Stick to your structures. Yeah. Play with instinct. I Balance think, it all out. I think they're definitely, like, believing in yeah, the game plan or belief. something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the they're way, trusting each other, too. Yeah. If you yeah. look at the way they spread from the contest... And Work you hard. look at, uh, there was a lot of times, have a look at it closely. There's a lot of like handballs, especially from Cribs and that. He's handballing, he's almost doing a Greg Williams. He's handballing yes. into position. Yep. Not where the player is. Yep. Where making he him sh- run there. Where right. he should be. If yeah. you look at it, and a lot of times they got onto the end, well, most of the times they got onto the end of it because he knows where he should be. Now, I still believe it's still going to take some time to get it all right. Of course, you know, of course. There's going to be like ups and downs, but... It's clicking at the moment. Oh, unbelievable. Well, I we've shown what we can do. Man, that second yeah, quarter. Was- unbelievable. I think the, the amazing thing is as well is the way we've improved our ball movement away from stoppage yep. and centre clearances. Quick and ball it's just, But that's what the best teams do. Oh, yeah. And I think the, the best... They're always looking for someone, aren't they? It's exact, but that's what you've got to do. Yep. Find the best option. Look, there's, look, there are going to be times where you've got to throw it on your boot. You just have to throw it on your boot, right? Just gain territory, get it out of there. But I think for me, the biggest thing is that I think a great comparison for for the way that you play premiership football at the moment is you look at all the best teams in soccer. All the best teams in soccer don't hoof the ball long. No, exactly. They don't sit back and then hoof the ball long and just hope. 
the best teams in soccer in world football short sharp direct passing similar to what a handball is yeah, right first time you can't be scored against if you've got the ball 100%. right so that's your best form of defense control the footy control the footy control position find the best option yep. yeah find the best option and go from there and what do the best teams do in world football and world soccer there's nothing there you go back go backwards. and you start again and yeah, we we are we per- we are purposefully trying to do that now yeah. You know, when the switch is on, sometimes there are switches on where that we should take, and probably yeah. from where we are in the stadium, you, you can, can see it. it. Yeah, yeah. They probably it's can't different see for it. the players at eye well, no, level, but at least they're and looking for it. There's pressure on them too. Exactly, <laughs> but at least they're looking for it. Yeah, yeah they're always you looking know. inside now, which is exactly. Good. It's not always just a bomb down. Well, they the line. wait, wait, wait. They go around, and then as soon as they find that inside man, they but go. But even if you see it down the line as well, it's changed. The eyes have lowered. It's not just I'm going to kick a 50, 55 meters exactly. and hope that Mackay can mark it, or you know, fucking Kerno or Pitana. It's lower the eyes, yeah. and they're looking for that the, the, the little 25 meter yep, pass down 100%. the line. Yeah. And if you notice too, the the eyes are definitely lowered into the forward line. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, always hard. does it all the time. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Always it's does. And Durden does too. Man. Gets the ball. We got we got a couple like, gee, McKay. Not only a great mark, but he's a great leader. Like Correct. a great, you know, well, like they leader. Got, they got fantastic separation Ration, away yeah. from their opponents on the weekend. Granted, look, I mean, I think the one thing for me that I took away from the game is, and we kept saying that. Our talls are going to get them. them. Yeah, of course. But you say that going into the game, but sometimes it's it does an adventure. It was nice happen. for us to say it was predictable. It See, sometimes predictability is your best friend. That's yep. it. Right? Of we knew we were going to get them there. We got them there. Yeah. and But even, you know, even Fantastic. the small guys brought the ball to the floor as well, I thought. Yeah, no, you know, no. Always, oh, yeah, I always did it well for that goal yeah, for Kerno snapping yeah, the third. Yeah, yeah, 100%. Uh, or was it the, yeah it was in the yeah, third yeah. turn no 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 uh, yeah, yeah in the third, in the third turn, turn. Yeah, yeah, always the went up yep. competed Correct. got the ball to, and Kerno was the one who roved right. yes that's and right and that is the beauty about the oh, forwards yeah. we have they're yeah. not just they're tall buggers and can't run they're dynamic mate how, how agile ground. are they no. even Harry can he can no. mate, Harry can run work, mate he's, um, well you look at the, some of those highlights man he was getting that ball like near the back line now, along the wing and that like he was he was and that's what I mean with those little 20, 25 meter kicks he, when he hits yeah. it up and then he can pass it off and then yeah, sprint 100%. back in you know and then when we are in danger like and we do have to kick it to a contest we got we got, we got those big boys we got the big boys who are going to take a exactly. mark exactly have you also noticed too and the first thing that every time I was looking up at the score you know the scoreboard they come up with your stats little, yeah. and I was looking through stats. the we are just getting a heap of the ball. Oh, yeah. Like, oh. we're, we're, I'm just, we're most. number one. We, we rank Average number touches. one for disposals. Yeah. How much? Average 390? disposals. 398. Because but of the sharing of the ball. So much. Exactly. Yeah. But you know what's the other thing I noticed all night? I don't know what it ended up with. Was the accuracy in the kicking yeah. and that? It, oh, it would have yeah, been up around yeah, yeah, 75. Yeah, yeah. It was real high. At one stage, it was 81, it was real 82. High. It's because they're not like rushing. Yeah. Is, Finding yeah. your best options. I also think too, and our, and you can see as well, our kick to handball ratio has really whittled away like yeah. L- yeah. the last two years i think last year and the year before like, we were first and second for kick to handball yeah. ratio so we would kick way more than yeah. we would handball now it's you see we're trying to generate the handball chain 100%. <clears throat> we're trying to generate that you know that one two three four then go yes and so, it's like drawing that player 100%. and then give off and it's, you can do it off the mark as well when Correct. you receive the mark you kind of look to play on and you get that we're getting that player off the half back and yeah. running past and using that body, you know. And I think the it's beauty different. about it too different. is that I think there's still a lot of improvement. improvement. To come oh, definitely. Oh yeah. To really get everything wait down. Wait till they get wait till they understand the game plan. Well, I yeah, don't even exactly. reckon they understand <laughs> it still. Wait till they really it, it the, really gets embedded yeah, into exactly, them. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. You know, like it's almost now that they've it's almost a bit of an instinct what they're doing, but I'm in six months time. It's like you're hoping, like near the finals, if we do are lucky enough to get there, that it's really going to be embedded in you. It's you know? incredible to think the turnaround in a four to five month period. I'm has just still been... freaking out, well, man. It's kind of like, like uh, we'll, I would never we'll pick talk, it. We're talking about Sydney, like last year. Yes. Yeah. 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 You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Same yeah, kind yeah, of thing. You know, it's like we're just like Very wheels similar. in motion. We're like a bang, bang, bang. Very like similar. I want to, I actually want to shout him out. He's uh, Silvani, I thought he yeah, had a rip mate, up. See, he, I'm sorry, he does not get enough love from us. Yeah. No, he doesn't, I, he doesn't. He no, just doesn't. I think he gets enough love from us. Does I don't think he gets enough love from, from everyone out. No, I, I don't it. think he gets enough love from our fans. 
I'm oh, sorry. He does no, a lot he doesn't. of that dirty Mate, work. Mate, he doesn't. I'm telling he you. But he does also, a goal. He's a link in the chain. Mate, 100%. I don't does. know how many score involvements he had he's or whatever. A third he's big, a link in the chain. He's he, a third tall. Remember, um, who was it? Tom, he's a Tom Lynch from um, Adelaide. Adelaide. Yeah. He, yeah, he's, he's like that sort of player. But I think he's, he can do more. He Len can, him. He can definitely okay. do more. And so, he's got heart, man. The yeah, absolutely. Bleeds blue. Absolutely. Love him. Yeah, he was Love fantastic. Him. And the one the one area that has really gone up, well, intercept marks is what yeah, yeah, you yeah. need to base your game on as well. But, but our rebound. tackles inside 450, oh, yeah. nine. And nine to five. What do we have last week? 14. 14. Well, we always had... I think Harry was always good at that, you know what I mean? But now with the small forwards putting that pressure on it. But it's also... The Harry's coming into it, and Kerno's yeah. always been yeah. like a man-man in there. Yeah. But Silvani's a man-man in there. It's the mids that roll up yes. into, the, yeah. into the 50, yeah. that, and then they're applying the pressure 100%. when they get tackled too. So it's good to see it's the mids. It's all going They're right. working it's, both it's ways. Always, look, there is a saying, not to put a dampener on what's... But Correct. it's never as good as it seems. Yeah, that's right. And it's never as bad as it seems. Just it's always somewhere... In between. In oh. the middle there, you know. You, you hit those outliers, that's which is probably what we've done now, but... You know, it's 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 looking the goods. And it's you know good as it seems. The midfield. It's good yeah. as it seems. It's, yeah, <laughs> it's exactly. good as it seems. I know. I, know. I, know. I love it. The man. midfield, they're the bullies now. Yeah, yeah. we are. Hundred percent. Look at him. Hundred percent. Look, my old man. Right. For, look, I mean, he he doesn't really ingrain himself in footy as much as he used to, but he always said to me, he goes, boy, he goes, mate, he goes, look at the players. He goes, they're, they're slow. He goes, there's yep. nothing of them. Yep. Yep. There's nothing there. He goes, look at Geelong. They're all huge. They can run. They're all big. Yep. Look at these boys in there. Yep. Look, mate. Cripps. Hewitt. Kennedy. Hewitt. Hewitt. Walsh. Yeah. Well, Walsh is getting there. Pin and it's big. Um, We're the bullies now. Yeah, 100%. Uh, and it all comes down to, and I know I've been bagging our captain for a few years now, and I, I still I'm justified, I'm justified in what he was doing, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. Now, there could have been reasons for it, whatever. Yep. It, was, it was like a, he was a poor captain. But at the moment... Like he, because of his bulliness, because of his the way he's uh, presenting himself in the middle, it has lifted everybody. Now you can see that when the opposition, they've got no choice but the two or three to go to him. They've got no choice because you get drawn to the ball. This is what frees up everybody. He's using it smarter. Well, as oh, well. he's not. He's trying to not doing too much. Yeah, he's absolutely, drawing the player. He's kicking the goal. <laughs> But That's what taking the huge... There is one thing he needs to work on, though, those left, left foot kicks. He can't kick yeah. on his left. <laughs> he can't kick. There's hey, actually one where he put 40 hey, metres on there. It's all right. At least he's having a go. At least nah, he's trying. And and that was one thing. It's it amazing. Hey, listen. It was one thing that the tr that the coaches said in the pre-season. You need to, and Weedering said it. He goes, you need to use your left foot. Yeah, more. You need to use your opposite foot. More. If you can't use your left foot, that like takes away a lot but, of your... But why was that not Abby being... Dexter's. Yeah, that's right. Before, of course. course. But look, that's all right that he's left foot because even Superman yeah. had kryptonite. Oh, well, yeah, I know. Of so course, there's of one course. Thing I, that's know, I know, get him, I know. So, I know. But apart you from can't that, be perfect. We're all, we department. are, all, we're all mortal. We're all, uh, you know, we're all mortals at the end of the day. And low P, low key. I'm not that I really give a shit because it means nothing. But to all whoever did that top twenty of all the Fords and all this mm. shit and putting Mackay here and there, mate. He's the Coleman medalist, mate. He's at the top. I know. Top of the food I chain. Know, I don't give a shit. I don't even know why they're like even On form, that. at the top of the food chain. 100%. Can't put Norton in front of him. Come on, bro. Nah. What did Norton do? He got two cheap free kick yeah. goals. That's what he 100%. got. That's, <laughs> and he that's missed, what he got. And he, got. and he missed those ones that he needed Clutch. to get at the exactly. end. Kyle would have kicked yeah. them. I'll pull my house well, on he everything. Did. Well, he did. He did, yeah. yeah. He did. And they were and harder. He, His shots were harder. And you know the thing was, like, even though he faded out in the, that, that last half. Did his damage. He set up. Yeah, in yeah. The he first did his half. damage, and, and then, then the come to the four. The other one, the other to tower the came. So the twin towers. When, when the small, when the small fords kick them and the big boys don't, the big boys do. Then the small fords don't. That's, so they're all doing their job. It's beautiful. That's, that's, that's what you want. You can't do it every week. It's, I uh, just want to just talk about a couple of moments here. I yep. thought were critical, right? Yes. So they might be in a different order, but I want you to go to. Uh, I want you to go to the doc, Mark, if you can, and have a look at this, right? I think it's number 22. Was this in the guts? Have a look at this, right? Yeah. yeah. Oh, How yeah. good is this? Now, Seriously, look at, look at that. Look at that. Look at the, the will and want to get there. Rolled off That's his a great pick. That's back. a great pick, yeah. man. Huge man. To it's me, a great when pick. I saw that, because they were kind of surging a little bit. Well, they and, were coming. Yeah, they, they were, were coming. fucking coming at and us. And he needed to take that mark. And that second grab, you can see that was pure domination. The other one is... The next one, which is the Crips. 
this one. Have a look at this one. Yep, yeah. love it. On Rourke Smith. Love I was at the top. Love yeah. it. And yeah. you mentioned love it. it before. Love it. Look at him taking two of them. And yeah. then he flawed this Rourke Smith. They tried to pull him down. <laughs> And he, he still, and he stood over him too. I like no one else saw it, but they all got up and I'm fucking stuck yeah. his head I in. I loved it because you know what he did. He laid the tackle onto Woz and he went like that yeah. into him. And then Crips like, who the fuck are you? I'm yeah. coming here now. I'm back in my boy. I'm thinking that's the Good. turning point. Yeah. to Cribs and everything. I'm telling you, that moment there, I stood up too. Yeah. And I was, oh, I was Good. loving it. I was man. shouting. That's what leaders. we need, mate. Because yeah. now we're going to say, man, you're not pushing nobody around, Correct. man. And uh, did he give away a 50 for that? No. No, there was no free kick. No, no free, free kick. kick. No free kick. No, no. Even if he did, Good I for don't the care. umpire to let it go. Yeah. No, nah, but Let's even the if there was a 50, out, you know? it was worth it. Yeah, Correct. No, it was worth it. Do not push. And there was three players on him. Loved it. He's the bull's Stand up for you, mate. Don't, Voss said it. You don't play. You play for your mates. Dude. You're there for your. You help your mates. And that's what I can see Selfless now. Selfless footy. I can see that now, and it makes such a huge difference. Correct. Man. You can see that they're mates, man. Like no one pushes. I'm telling you, you're not going to win a premiership if you're not 22 or 30 best yeah. mates, man. And it's nice to see them play with a smile. Ah, good. That's when you know they're enjoying their yeah, footy. Yeah, it's nice and to it see. Comes easy. Winning helps. <laughs> hey, and uh, look, but the hard work brought the winning you know yeah, like exactly. the hard work has exactly. brought the winning and yeah. like don't forget to like we had such an interrupted week yeah. we didn't know if oh, players yeah. were going to play what the bloody hell was going on the coaches weren't there we boss no wasn't there we won without a coach well <laughs> and the Calabria was going to come back Chera yeah, Chera's, yeah, Chera was out Martin was out Breeze Fogarty face. played a role I love yeah. Fogarty's game hey he played a role man I loved it even though he set up that easy little one doesn't matter it's what you he do made up for it. He made up for he it. He did it. You know what? You know when I saw Fogarty play, Fogarty is a Fogarty. Fogarty, Fogarty, whatever. Fogarty. When I saw Fogarty play, Much right, of a muchness. Yeah. Right. I thought this is brilliant because he's come in and he did his role. One out, one in. About, there was one a out, position one to in. be taken, yep. and he yes. did it. It wasn't about oh, we've lost a great player. How are we going to replace him? No, no. We've lost a position. Yep. Let's just put someone in there, and he did it. I said to him, I'm like, I reckon he stays in for next well, week. Well, that, his four-quarter well, effort was better than Martin's. 100%. Martin, I, so I, what I, do you do this week? I know Martin's got more ability than Fogarty, but I thought that Fogarty's four-quarter was way better I'm than Martin's you, one quarter. This is going to be a big decision to make. It's good. It's a good headache to have. I love 100%. it. It's a good headache to have. 100%. And the way that... You know, like when Cherok, the announcement come in, oh, here we go, we won a game and now this is happening. But what the best clubs, the most professional clubs, that's, it is what it is. Yeah. That's it. It has now, to be. Now we've got our contingencies you can't in dwell place. On it. If this happens, this is the cog, we, this is the 100%. gear we pull. If that happens, that's the gear we pull. If this happens, this is the player that comes 100%. in. And so Cripper said it too. Like it's, one man out, another man in. Has That's it. I'm glad that they're saying in. that. Well, it's what premiership teams do. Because if do. we're thinking it, so are they. Exactly. They're thinking the and same thing. Even me, like on social media, I'm trying to get people to, like, don't be in the dumps with it all. Like, nah. just, it's, oh, well, hey, all right, it's happens. happened. Go again. Come on. Let's go. Come on. I was actually, when Chera was out. I wasn't worried. I wasn't that worried. No, neither though. was I. And then Walsh come in and I was happy and I thought, oh yeah, that's good, you know. Um, I don't know. I, I wasn't. You know usually, what it, I would. Now, I would you know what it is? I think like people were, like hanging on to last year and the year before, and that because yeah, we had we weren't winning games and we're just going there for players. I don't blame and, them. You know, we've been waiting blame. for them to Correct. do something. Correct. But blame. now it's now it's beautiful. I want to big up different. My man, the most L-O-B. improved, the most improved player who I declared on the Carlton Football Club official TikTok page. Yeah, Lockie O'Brien. Yeah. That's his best game he's ever played in. If, if people positions, are though. still uh-huh. lambasting Lockie O'Brien after that game, you do not understand football. No. I'm sorry, you don't. I don't care if that's, that's condescending his, to people done. now. Because if you understand football, you understand what his the role. wing position yeah. is and, yeah. and the way you have to play that role. Oh, he didn't get contested possessions. No, he's, he's not there to get contested possessions, Neil Garnett. He's a winger. That's, that's, that's why right. he got Cripps, Hewitt, and I put up on and, Twitter, and 22 Uncontested yeah. possessions. Yeah, and I think two goal assists. And listen, how goal? many times did no. he get the ball at half back and off two steps lace out to Kerno? Name me one player off half back that could do that. He's done well. Name man. me one person. Who are you gonna and then oh no no Lockie O'Brien can't play. Oh who do you want to put in? Cottrell. No. I put no at the start of the year, I had no confidence in Oh, oh put put Dow in. Dow can't run through on a wing. Oh, we'll rest Walsh on a wing. Rest nah, on a wing. 
You want to rest on a wing. You know where the you know where you got to run the most. That's the most. You know where you know where he rests on the wing on the bench there. That's where he rests there. While Shenchera and Setafield could potentially alternate through that wing position, right? But I want those blokes to be rotating on the ball because that's where they're best served. Yeah, of course. The wing position is a specialist role. You can't just put a bloke there because maybe O'Brien only got 15 touches or O'Brien only got 20 touches. That's what you do with the 15 or Exactly, yep. exactly. And when it was his moment to go in the contest and he nailed Ed Richards. Yep. Yeah, nailed 100%. It. 100%. Back him. Yeah, that was a great, great goal. Back him. The wing position is a specialist role. Well, I'll, I'll back my players when they show something. And he did. He's shown something. He did. He's shown something. Yeah, no, no, no. It's, I'm telling you, it's his best it's game. building. That he could be. Building. That could That's be. That's his turning point. That could that be game. the turning point for him. I think no, you no, pick definitely. a base off. Look, that. you did pick it. You did pick it. You did pick it. No, you did pick it. Well, it's it, it's because they've realised that. Well, keep your wit, son. That's the wing role, isn't yeah. it? Base your game off yeah. Langdon from Melbourne and Amon from Port Adelaide, yeah. who I just think quietly we're in for next year, just quietly. But I'll, uh, I'll, uh, anyway, <laughs> early call, um, early call. But mate, I. I was super impressed with his nah, game. Nah, super impressed with his game. I'm, game. I'm right. Very good game. You know who else? Kerno played a good game, man. Eh? Oh, Charlie. Fucking hell. Goodness Bro. gracious me. I've actually Five got straight. some footage here. Oh, okay. God, here we go. Oh yeah. oh, yeah. Of the doggies oh. and Charlie. Oh. Have a look at this. Ah! Ooh. <laughs> Ouch! 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 Charlie! <laughs> <laughs> that was a Western Bulldogs, they all laughing. Oh, Charlie, what's he going to do? And then it was like, oh, oh, oh Charlie, Charlie. Really <laughs> that, last goal, that last goal hurt, didn't it? Yeah, love that. No, hey, he this, was seriously nah, back. Mate, he was Fine seriously form. back. Yeah. Hey, but listen, me and you, we were confident in this week, weren't we? Yeah. Oh, well, Someone wasn't. Yeah, oh, fuck it. Let's yeah. have a look at this. Oh, Let's have a look at last oh, week. God. What do you reckon? <laughs> I think we're going to lose in a very, very, very close game. Oh, God. No, from us. I think Kerno and Mackay can... Well, I think one of them... There'll be eight goals between them next you week. Cop, you cop. I reckon it'll be a, a nail-biter. Oh. Uh, Carlton by 10 points. Oh, yeah. I, I'm going to do the same. I'm going to do Carlton by less than 12, 12 points, you know? So I'm going to be a good goal game. mark. So I... Sorry. <laughs> now, because last week you you made sure you, we put on the video about you getting it right. Oh, well, this week you got it right. Okay, no, no, okay. it's all I'm good. Happy you to had get no, it wrong. You had no confidence. No. But me I and you, no, no, I didn't. No, I didn't have no confidence. <laughs> zero. No, it zero wasn't zero. Nominal. I just thought the doggies had rebound, but clearly we're a better team. Clearly, yeah, you don't know footy. <laughs> no, I loved it. But yeah, hey, Carlton, we picked the two goals, but mate, you picked the eight goals between well, them, and they nine. kicked nine. Yeah. So. Lift up your lift up your fucking effort there. Because, like, <laughs> nah, that was that was a good pickup though. Yeah, maybe I'll be taking over his his role soon. Yeah, as I role in the multi I department. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> see how this multi. We'll talk nah, about nah, that nah. later. We'll later. talk about that later. No, nah, no. Nah, see, that was a that was a yeah. Oh, good. Well. So massive game, massive game. Hey, listen. Yeah. There's some votes. There are votes. Yes, there are indeed. All right. Who wants to go first? I'll go first. Let's uh, do it. So five, obviously, to the $6 million man himself. Yeah. Paddy Cripps gets the five. Uh, he'll be leading the brown load this quietly, I think. He'll, be, he'll definitely be getting the three he'll votes. He'll be leading round everything at the moment. Uh, four to Charlie Kerno. Thought yep. he was fantastic when he needed to be in that last quarter. Really stood up. Kicked, some, kicked that clutch goal in the third. Oh. Kicked the two clutch goals in the last. Bang, bang, bang. Three to Big H, Big Harry Mackay. Yep. Two to George Hewitt. Thought he did a fantastic yep. job on Bonton Pally when he was starting to get on top. Yep. Toiled away all night. And one to Bam Bam, Matt Kennedy. Thought yep. his last quarter was fantastic. Yeah. Honourable mention to Walsh, but I couldn't get him in there. Yeah, nah. Surely, like, you could have given one to O'Brien. Honourable mention. Oh, Honourable yeah. mention, yeah. Could have yeah. fucked it nah. after the big rap. Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 he's in some esteemed company. No, there no, he's, he's, a it's, that one, I'm telling you, that one vote is hard to give. It that one and two is hard to give. Well, that's good. That's when you know that like 20 of them are playing good football. Team football. That's right. Our I mean, votes are hard, which is good. You're all right. Oh, that's not right. Okay. Go. Uh, five to Kripendakia. The Kripendakia. Everyone's going to hate me here, but if you do, you don't. I don't really give a shit. I'm going to give four to Walsh. Purely okay. because no, oh, okay. purely yep. right. purely because 
he's come off a syndesmosis. He's had surgery, what, three, four weeks ago? About a month or so ago. First quarter comes out and just, just runs a quiet four kilometres or yeah. 3.7. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Has 35. Yeah. Third quarter, I'm telling you right now, he's just pivotal. Off half back, and he was getting those little one tours in the in the he middle. He drilled out a little chisel at Akuno in the last as well. That's his first uh, game back. Mate, <laughs> that's a marker, and it, apparently it's <laughs> shit. But yeah. anyway, I'll give him four. Charlie oh, gets yeah. three. He was... He was electric, yeah. he was on fire. I'm going to give two to Zach Williams. Good on you. Ooh, Balenciaga, Balenciaga gets in there. It's one of his better Please. games. I thought he, his game was underrated by a lot. Like, you might not see it, but the way he, he set us up up half back yeah. and feeding players. Well. Mate, he went by footy. I watch, I've watched the game back about, I think, three full times, like in, in full. He maybe missed one or two targets, if no. that. Well, it's amazing okay. what happens when he has a defined role. Yeah. You say, oh, we think and you're going to be a midfielder. We think you're no, going to be the... You're no, no, back. You're a half-back flanker this so, year, mate. Yeah, I thought, he, I, thought he was, I thought he was really good. Perfect. And he, I think he had like 10 or 11 score involvements in those chains. And I'm going to give one to Mackay. Of course. Yep. Who set us up in the first half. Big H, Mackay. Big yeah. H. The Kraken. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I've given five, of course. The $6 million man. <laughs> or to Kerno. I think in the second yeah, half, like yep. he was Matt, just yep. 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 I didn't huge, think. man. They'll go three to McKay because in the first half, he was the one, you know, like he's the one who set us up. Then Kerno finished us off. Definitely. Two to Kennedy. Kennedy, Hewitt, where do you go, man? But I thought Kennedy in the last quarter, 14 possessions, man. 14 possessions. Huge. Yeah, it was that's huge. Massive. It was huge. So after that stage, oh. <laughs> and I gave one, this is going to be a bit of a surprise, Pitonet. Oh, okay. All right. I like that. Uh, I like that. He, yeah, yeah. I was saying last year, yep. the bloke cannot the hit wine. a person, mate. Just tap it to somebody. How many hit outs to advantage did he have? 14. Heaps. He had heaps. Yeah, he had about 14. He had heaps. I think I was in the you look at that half. third wa- yeah. quarter again. See how many times he's hit him straight on the chest, Down mate. Down their throat. Yep. But it's the way we set up, too. I was saying yeah. to Rocco before. That's correct. They play the. T- yeah. the, the if you watch us. There's just two midfielders behind the ball yeah, instead yeah. of they were forward of yeah, the ball. Yeah. Now it's different. They've set him At up least he knows where he's in the two. 100%. 100%. Yeah, and they're well, there. I like that one. No, no, I'm telling you, I'm impressed with. I kept saying he's just a big, like, bully, you know, but you know what? All right, and he. He does a couple of stuff ups. They're, they're almost a Percy oh, Jones. They're, they're rucks. Rucks. They're big dopey boys. <laughs> they're always they're a Percy Jones kind of there, mate. Yeah, yeah, big dopey but, boys. Oh, man, no, no. no, he's good. He's coming good. along well, yeah. the LDY. Yeah. And I keep, well. I don't, as I keep saying, he's still very inexperienced yeah. for rucks. Oh, he's, he's only 24? Played, he's only played at no, 25, I think, but he's only played 40 odd games. 40 odd games. So, no, no, he's and good. Hawthorne was spewing to lose him, too. Yeah, I'm telling you. And you know, like, they reckon the ruck a couple more years. Can I just quietly say as well? Everyone doubting the sauce rebuild and all the plays he picked up. They seem to be playing it right now. Don't yeah, they? yeah, yeah. They seem. Oh well, some. I mean, some were, oh. some weren't. But you're right. The there rough, are the rough ones. Oh yeah, yeah. Pitonet. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Pitonet yeah, yeah. was a good one. Yeah, yeah. No, definitely, definitely, definitely. There. It's all the working out sauce. together. Yeah, yeah. Hey, listen. Oh, yeah. Everyone's a fucking general after the battle. So That's we'll, see. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see how we go. We'll see how we go. We'll see how we go. But at the moment, it's all looking good. Hey, leaderboard. <laughs> Leaderboard, leaderboard. Oh, Crips, Crips. 30. Yeah. <laughs> Straight up. Crips is bounding away. Very yeah. roads off Kennedy and on 13. Yes. Kerno. Charlie. 11. He's comes up there. into the Straight away. Charles. Uh, Chera doesn't play. He's still in fourth spot, nine. And then we've got Hewitt on six. So, nice. look, all the big names are there. They so are. They are. It's good. This is a... This is good, man. I like a this... bit of love for Williams there. Yeah, I like that. Oh, yeah, I, I just thought it was different. I, I, like, I like Pitonet as well. So. Yeah, yeah Pitonet. Uh, but I'm telling you, with Williams, you're right, man. They're playing him in the right spot. Oh, that's what he is. Defined role. Far out. It's the same with O'Brien. Defined role. You're on a wing. Keep your wit. Stay out there. Yeah. You know who's bloody excited about this? Who? Let's have a look back and see. Who? what. Let's have a look. Joey again. <laughs> <laughs> but look at him! He's twirling! <laughs> Ow! Is that Vinny Katojo spinner? <laughs> That's Vinny Katojo in the back, I love it! That's the ladies in the back! Oh, oh so it. good! How good is it? Nah, oh, man, oh, he's golly. loving it, man. He's Fuck loving it. Nah, love nah, him. I listen, and everyone. Love him. Nah, he's a star. And everyone catch up with his podcast, yeah, the Almost, Almost Blues Brothers. Blue Brothers. Get on yep. Definitely catch up. It's another good podcast. Uh, well, you know the blues, the blue fans. Yeah, we've got so much 
like a uh, product out there. Oh, content. content. It's madness. It's madness. It's incredible, mate. And there's a, listen, there's a couple of shitty ones, but there's a couple of really good. I'm not going to name. There's a couple <laughs> of really good content out there. So really good. Namely. The jump punch? Man. Nah, well, oh. listen, I don't want to go name them. So I'm talking about uh, the other stuff. There uh, are some good ones the out there. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, no, no. Listen, listen, listen. Next week, we've got a big game. Sunday. We have got Carlton v. Hawthorne. This is now 1v. Are you excited for this? I I'm am. so excited. Oh. I'm just so Sunday, the 3rd of April at 1 10 p.m. <laughs> it's going to be at. Uh, at the G? Yes, at the at MCG, the our hey, home listen, game. One thing I want to say is there was only 34,000. Not only, there was a not bad crowd. I really expected Thursday more. Thursday game, though. Well, yeah, all right. Yeah. This is Sunday. Oh, it's Sunday. 60, what are you doing 000, on a Sunday? What are you 60, doing on a Sunday? 60,000, guys, man. I'm telling you if, you, if you don't go and see the Blues now. We need all the plastics out there. We need the bandwagoners to come out. And you know out. what? I was it. thinking, like, they were like big, big tests. I know every week's a big test, but this becomes a big test it now. Does. Yeah, yeah. It's they gonna be a right. good game. It'll be a good they game. Look all right, all right. It'll be a cracker. Let me, I hope Calm let, don't do that let me face. Tell you, let me tell you, mate. That's Port, an ugly Port face. Port Adelaide are underdone, mate. I don't care what anyone says, mate. Yeah, yeah. I know, but I don't care about Port Adelaide. I know. I, I care know. about what Hawthorne have been doing in the last now, few weeks. If we play like we did in the first two weeks, we should win it. Yeah. How do we lose? No, we don't. You know, so. I don't know what we. I don't know what anyone's. No, doing. no, I'm actually confident. I, I, I understand. I'm saying that. it's a good challenge. It is. It is. It, it, it's and like and this is the thing that Vossi kept talking about: consistency. Yeah. You know, Hawthorne are playing good football at the moment. There's no doubt about that. But I mean, like our midfield is just worry about our own game. Yeah, of course. Yeah. But you've you got to yeah. worry about them too. Yeah, yeah. But you know, you've you've got to be wary of them. Make sure you lock down on their forwards. Yeah, they are dangerous. And Gunston looks like another his, challenge. Right? Gunston Speed looks again. like he's back Speed to again. his best. Yeah, yeah. after as well. Out, yeah. So Sicily they're down playing back. different too to what they were last year. Well, under Sam Mitchell, yeah, yeah, of course, yeah, definitely, of course. Definitely. It's gonna be good. Two new coaches. You know, two you've got two it, new yeah. game styles. They're coming up. Right. You know, one and, and six. And you know. Hawthorne gave us the jitters last year. Yeah. Mate. So, look, granted, I mean, we were we weren't exactly by in the greatest a, form. Yeah. Coached by a banana. Yeah. yeah. So, no, I'm, I'm actually super excited, man. I've had the first two weeks, but this week is then another challenge. Like la- last week, uh, the doggies was can we back it up against a good side? Correct. And then they cha- I was wrapped. They challenged us. Good. Honestly, like it, instead of winning are. by 60, 70 points, I was wrapped with the challenge and the way. Because if you notice the different gears in that last quarter, yeah, how they just slowed it down when they needed to. Well, the, the, just going back on the game, it. you know, we had those stupid turnovers in the last yeah. sort of... But we, we had control of the game. Yeah, it, yeah, it was yeah. un, just stupid, unforced. Yeah. Just and you can, nervy But kicks. you can see what they were trying but, to they do. Weren't even, but they weren't even nervy kicks. Yeah, nah. No one was on him. No. Centerfield had no one on him. Sard had no, no one on him. I thought they were just lazy. Just lazy, just lazy but football. That, you know what? You can, that can be trained. Yeah, that can be yeah. trained. It's, it's go lazy. back, do 20 of those. 100%. Do 20 of those kicks in that scenario when you're fatigued, and we go again. 100%. But we set ourselves up in the uh, first half. Davvero. So then we could yep. we could uh, afford a couple of mistakes, you know? So yep. it's all good. But this week, correct. I'm telling you, man, I'm telling you, man, the big game, mate. Can I just say, get to the game. Get to I the game. I keep saying it. Get there. Get to the game. It's Look, it's, it has been good. The first two weeks, man. Like the crowd. Right. If we really got 60, mate, 70, 80,000. Fucking get... Nah, dead set. Like, it has you, to be 50, 60,000. It has to be. Listen, if you outnumber love them. a buzz in your life, right? There was nothing like walking out of that game as the winner and listening to the crowd. Oh, like down the ramps and stairs. We were at the chaos. platforms. They were chaos. singing the song. Chaos. It was like it was like extreme. And there was this one person. She was wearing a Hawthorne scarf for some reason at the platform, you know. And the bloke walked up to her, you know, all oh, nice. There was nothing. Yeah, yeah, and he's yeah. going, oh, he's going, oh, you worried for next week? You know? <laughs> <laughs> you know, the so, swagger's back. Yeah, the I swagger's love back. I, I love, love it. it. The love finger it. pointing's back. It's good. Yeah. It's good. The Carlton arrogance. We love the no, Carlton no, arrogance. Good. Prediction? It's good. It's back. Hey? Hey? Predictions again. Yeah, so we're going to definitely do the prediction since now it's... Uh, Carlton it's, by six goals. It's Carlton by six. Yeah. I'm going to go straight up. Yeah. The chair is back. chair is back. It's going to be strong, man. Strong midfield. Carlton by 55. Oh! <laughs> I like it. Good luck. 26 to count. Yeah. So what'd you say? Uh, six goals, 36 points. All right. I don't write them down. Scrivy. 26. Scrivy. What am I? What'd you say? 36 points. Oh, six 36 goals. and 55. All right.
Give them All back right. some of their own medicine, what they did I love for. this, man. Good this luck. Good, that's that's Good arrogance luck. plus there, man. Hi, Jaeger. Get a few Jaeger oh, bombs yeah. into your dog. Nah, we could do it. We're coming for your knee. <laughs> We're coming for him, mate. Fuck I love it. We're coming, mate. Mitch Lewis, five and straight Vossi. next week. You're fucking dreaming, mate. Hey, and Vossi's, mate. You're dreaming. I hope he runs out and just runs through literal. <laughs> Wouldn't that be Tom the best? Mitchell. I want him to do a Percy oh, Jones. I want him Mitchell. to fight with I don't the coach. I what he does. Just go out there and Just go win. out there, win, and That's smash it. it. That's it. Hey, listen. 55, lol. Because of the success of the seniors. Yes. The reserves. If you notice all the premiership, they're always their reserves play well. Yep. So let's. We bring him back. A favourite. The ray of the reserves. And you've got a bit of an announcement what you're doing next week too, aren't you? Yes, I'll, uh, I do have a bit of an announcement actually. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. Uh, so I got a, a, a contact from uh, an esteemed gentleman who's uh, doing all the AFL streaming and the VFL for the... VFL streams for the AFL. Yep. And uh, I've been asked to, uh, to help lead the charge in the, uh, in the commentary department. So I'll be calling... Woo! Thank you very much. I'll be uh, I'll be out there at uh, Collingwood's uh, training facilities. They're uh, playing a VFL game against Geelong, so I'll be in there as the uh, double agent uh, and doing some reconnaissance work for for Michael. Yeah, no, that's it's, uh, no, yeah, good announcement there. So uh, yeah, bravo, it's a uh, reward mate. for some hard well work. Well done, mate. You toiling away that. at VFL level. They've been watching. Especially, I reckon they saw last week's call. Una bomba. No, una bomba. Well, you know what, mate? Can you chuck that in <laughs> into the call? Yeah. Come on. Oh, all right, okay. Try, see Imagine if you can that. do just okay. one quick what order do. bomber. I'll see what I can try. I'll see. I'll if see. you do... I'll see. Uh, I'll see what be. I can do. I'll see what I can do. No promises, but... Uh, yeah, no, it's... it's that's, and maybe see, ch this is the jump. players. The players down in the reserves. You've got to realise. Yeah. You've got to work hard down in the reserves and you'll get your reward for effort. Just 100%. Like yourself, 100%. So. so what happened in the Speaking reserves? Speaking of the reserves, it was a great performance. 11 18 84 to Carlton. The Brisbane Lions, 5 12 52, uh, 42, 5 12 42. So, behind. a 42 yeah. point victory to the Blues as they salute in round one of the VFL Premiership season. A dominant display. Should have won by more. Had yeah, complete like control 18. of the game. Uh, at the, the conditions were not exactly horrible. Like, it was play. a perfect night. Friday. Yeah, Friday night. Yeah, Friday after the night. game. So. Um, look, not the most amazing crowd, but 5pm on a Friday, I mean, people are still finishing up yeah, work nah, and stuff nah, and all that, so, uh, but no, dominant display, uh, it was, uh, yeah, probably one of the better displays I've seen in the VFL for the last year. I don't know how good Brisbane are going to be in this VFL competition, I mean, we don't really know at the moment who the benchmark is and, and what that's, but we look, we look really, and... The one thing that really stood out to me was, again, like you can see the Voss DNA being brought down into the reserves, the That's pressure around the want. contest, short, sharp passing, looking to switch, Fantastic. looking to get out the back, using the handball chase too, and the midfielders, <clears throat> pardon me, the midfielders had a heap of the ball. Um, so we'll go through it. Now, the leading possession getter on the ground was actually a, a young gentleman by the name of Will Hayes. Oh, yeah, I heard that, yeah. So he was recruited from Footscray their VFL team, and he's now been put on the Carlton Blues uh, VFL list. Hayes, and he is, yes, he's David Hayes, the yeah, trainer's trainer. son. So he's, uh, he might be giving the boys a few tips over yes. the spring Yeah, yeah that's, so it, that's it, He had 33 touches and two goals, so he could put, and six tackles, so he could potentially be one of those players we get in the mid-season yeah. draft, potentially, because we do have that spot open on our list. list. I know yeah. our midfield is pretty jacked at the moment. It's good to have more. But you just don't know. Someone could go down. We just don't know. Um, Dow was great, 32 and a goal. His influence around the contest was phenomenal. Plenty That's of clearance we work, plenty of run and carry. Kicked a fantastic goal on the run. Is it you know your typical Paddy Dow yeah. type of play? Get Arch the ball, the burst bus. through yeah, the yeah. burst through a couple of players, and have the shot for goal. He nailed that. Good. Nunes was good, 30 and a goal. Cottrell not too bad, 25 and a goal. Lewis Young defended really well. Um, he had 21 touches, um, held his opponent really well. So. Wow. He, he would be, well, that's, and that's what I wanted to see yeah. with Omac having these back spasms, back spasms which is, yeah. I, I don't know if that's a um, a symptom of him having the stress fractures in the back last year. That's I don't right. know. I don't well, know. No one knows. We'll I find out in the injury report. So well, if, will we? <laughs> if Oscar no, well, McDonald... We'll find out what they want to tell yeah. us. <laughs> <laughs> if Oscar McDonald's not fit enough, he'll play. Lewis Young can come into the team with a good 
you know, with a yeah. good you know, a head of form under huh? him. Yeah, good foundation. A head of ploughman? Oh, oh, God. Oh, yeah. Well, he said, well, ploughman's not tall enough. So, ploughman also know, can't run. Um, so, yeah. And he looked a little bit more composed, Lewis Young. Okay. So, whether it was the opposition not putting a lot of pressure on him, you know, because we saw in the AFL preseason games, he was a bit rushed yeah, yeah. with the way he used the ball. But anyway, he was not. He was good. Um, Williamson, yeah, yeah, sixteen touches, yeah. You're Nothing saying you're a bit sure about him. Yeah, on. I don't know. I was expecting him to really ramp yeah, it up. Twenty twenty-five. Actually, last week he was our emergency. He and, was, and, and this week he wasn't. Yeah. Obviously, so look, he was okay without being amazing. Sixteen touches. Um, yeah, not, nothing to really suggest he'd come straight back into the team with. Um, Jordan Boyd with 19. I go, Jesse Motlock, 15 touches. Sorry, I uh, didn't kick forward. a goal, but he's just he's lively. And he's not one of these players. I think what I noticed with him, he's not one of these players, and I hope he's not, that's going to just disappear out of the game. Yeah, yeah. You're always going to see him. He's yeah. you know, and, and every time that's he gets, right. every time he's around the ball, your, your typical Indigenous player, bang, it's, yeah. something happens. It's yeah. just, you know, they're, they're just buzzing around. The exactly. Buzz over. of electricity. So, yeah, good. look, look, if, if, look, Durden's had that, you know, he had a bit of a, a down game against yeah. the Bulldogs, Bulldogs yeah. you know, but that's going to happen with of small course, forwards. Uh, but if he has another game, like a down that. game, Motlop's hot on his tail. Motlop is hot on his tail. Want. So that's positive. Murkov, 14 touches and 30 hitouts. Parks, 12 oh, wow. touches, defended well. I've noticed with Parks as well, he's really backing in his kicking ability now, which okay. is good. He hit Dow up for this sort of 30, 35 metre laser pass through the middle. That was really nice. Um, Kemp was a bit down, only had seven touches. Now, Dom Aku. Now, he's a young Sudanese boy that we picked ah, up through yes. the rookie draft, yes. right? An athletic beast. Just He jumps 85 stories high. <laughs> he gets his fist to the ball. Like, he only had two touches, right? But he's playing as a key defender. And he actually defended really well. I think the only thing now is that when they're in that developmental stage as an 18-year-old, right, you're sort of like, you're on the balance between, okay, well, my first role, I've got to learn how to defend as a footballer, Correct. right? Because I don't think football was his sport from like being from a baby to yeah, where course, he is yeah. now. So I think the idea for him first is, okay, defend your opponent first, then worry about winning the ball. I think that will start to come as he progresses through yeah. the year and he'll start to get a little bit more confidence. But I like what he's courageous. He doesn't yeah. back down. He goes up into the contest. Yeah, yeah. So I think we need to start utilising a guy with that type of athletic ability. Kind of so, like the Alir Alir type. Correct. Just, mold, keep yeah. a re- just keep an eye on him. Yeah. Just put he's an asterisk on him. He might player, right? Yeah, he's an, a year Absolutely. or two. Absolutely. Him year and Merkov are the project players with our club. Yeah. 100%. You know, and I think those two types of players are really going to be a, sh- a sign of where our development is at as a club. Yeah. You know, if we can bring on those type of players, you, you just don't know. So yeah. I like what Merck, he's got his hands on the ball. Um, he's, a, he's a huge, he's, he's huge, he's massive. Like 215. Massive, ma- he's like 2 two eleven or something like that. Ridiculous. Massive bloke, but... Um, Ex-volleyball player, isn't he? Correct. Oh, Domaku, just just keep a keen eye on him. My keep a keen eye on him. I'm yeah, going to be keeping my eye on him. But he's graced by the wrong number, 41. Oh, oh no! But anyway, we we'll keep going. Keep the asterisks on Domaku. So like, great like start it, to the mate. year for the reserves. I like and I love. I am going to put up. Uh, I am going to put up a video um, going into a bit more depth. Yep. With regards. So that's to the all reserves. coming back. So of it'll, that'll be coming back this year. When oh, I, I'll oh. definitely get the time, and I will. Even if I don't get to the games, now that they've been streamed, I'll be able to watch them. So of course. I That's the day of the reserves. Good start. Great reserves. start all round. It's it's been we won, our AFL team winning. won. Our VFL team won, and our VFLW team also got up, which I called on the weekend yes. too. So that's why we're going to have some limoncello. Is this the one for Marcucci? No, that's no, no, this, this is your is one. one. I yeah. didn't finish that. Yeah, Jesus. We, we wiped Lord. that off last. <laughs> Doing double shots today. So I, I it's did. nice to have the re of the reserves back, I love and people it. really like the content too. I think 100%. people who are really ingrained with the club want to see what's going on down 100%. in the reserves. You know, we it's actually, an important part of the club. They actually, um, they asked for it. So they should, they and they're going to get it. So, so, and they got it, yeah. So that's fantastic. Let's have a drink. Cheers. <sighs> Salute. Are we decan or? No, I, just... I say, I save for the limon. I'm, I'm going to save this one. Oh, fuck you, Nimi. Sorry, what hey. a dog, man. Cheers. That's malfortuna, mate. <laughs> that's, for, that's malfortuna. <laughs> that Cheers. Is. You're like my missus when we do cheese. It's nice, man. Nice. If you don't look at her, 
She goes, what, why why do you even do cheers for? You know, you have to look him in the eye. You've got to look him in the eye. Look him in the eye. Got to look him in the eye. <laughs> hey, let's do a little bit of... Rocco's hey. Rant. Well, wow. AFL Tour. Okay, okay AFL Tour. Tour. Slash Rocco's, Rocco's Rant. Rocco's Rant. Rant. This is Rocco's Ram Part 1. Oh, God. There's Part 2 a bit Ooh. later on, all right? It's like so the Rocky movies. It's a bit of... <laughs> <laughs> Rocky, Rocky 1? The Godfather. Watch out for Rocky 2. No, Rocky 2 is a bit of a different thing, I thought I, okay. I want to say all right, right all at right. the end. But this is Rocky's, uh, right. Rocco's Ram. Let's hear it. The first one is... Let's have a look at the video. Okay. So, you can see this. Look at this. Now, I, what I've done is, oh, we've done a bit of a close-up here. All right. Okay. Yeah. We all saw that? Yeah, we saw that. Stop it. Stop it. Don't do that. Do not fake the free kicks. Don't do that. You're better than that. Now, I've heard people during the week saying they like it. Just get the free kick because that's what they do in soccer. Stick your round ball. This ain't round ball. Do not do it. Lockie, please, do not get known for these fake free kicks. There's no Go hard at the ball. Do not fake the free kicks. I think that is an ugly look. If that was the opposition, we would be bagging them now. I remember once, uh, what's his name? What's the bloody Essendon's full forward name? Lloyd. Lloyd. He once got caught a couple of times for yeah. diving. And he said that was one of the worst things he'd done because of what he was known for after that, right? Don't do it! Do not do that, man. What are we doing here, mate? Like, seriously, man, you did. there was nowhere near it, right? I've actually got some behind-the-scene footage of Lockie Right, and when you see this, you'll see how bad this looks. Have a look at this. <laughs> don't do it, man. I don't know what your opinion is. I don't like it. I don't like it, man. I don't like the fake freaky. The extra maybe. mustard. Yeah. Yeah. I don't like Look, it. Look, I man. think the one against Richmond. Oh well, he got clean. I'm he not got talking about clean. the one. Like, in it Richmond. was, uh, you know, that was. He yeah, put okay. some bravery on it. This one, he didn't and he go got, near He got his head. poetic justice. Yeah. I'm telling you, don't do it, man. Don't Fair do enough. it. And I'm sure that the coaching are going to say the same thing, man. Don't do it. Don't be known for that player. Go in hard for the ball. I want you to do that. Do not fake the free kicks because I'm telling you that's not one trait. This is not, again, the round ball. It's a different game. We are not known for that. Let's not do it. I do agree because the umpires will then begin to look for look it. 100%. For it, yeah. And the moment, you know, you it's, know you it's, like the boy who cried, it. it's like the boy who yeah. cried wolf. When he does 100%. get taken high, uh, he won't get taken high. He can get charged for, for uh, staging. staging. Well, that's Correct. right. I, cop, I'm, not, I'm not saying he will. You, are, you cop maybe a fine. Maybe no, they, they, the AFL cleared it. They, they cleared it? Okay, all right. They cleared it for okay. now, but I'm telling you, don't do it, man. That's yeah. my rant, yep. man. Does not bloody do it. Do not do it. Hey, second on the agenda, one of the big moments in AFL history happened the other night. Yes. We'll put this in the corner. Have a look at this, man. Unbelievable. What do you think about this? Oh, now, I want you to look at this. Look at this. The crowd is running on before he's even kicked the ball. So what were they going to do if he missed? But look at these scenes, man. It's unbelievable. It's like a swarm of ants to to sugar. Look at it. It was actually like amazing, man. 20,000 people on the ground. Crazy. It was crazy, man. Crazy. And he actually... um, he dealt with it really he good. Did. Yeah, he did. Yeah, like a lot of players, because they were like ripping him from I'm behind, and there was no one. There was no one left when they cleared the ground. No one stayed. They, they like basically nearly everyone left. Yeah, that's it. He was unreal. Look at this. This is another another angle of it. They're just running, and it, they, it's just amazing, this man. Is I've an seen it. Incredible that. scene. Oh, well, You're I've that, seen it a few times. I don't think we're going to see it too many more times. Not no. for the hundred, not for the hundred, not for the thousand. You wouldn't have thought so, no. no, you wouldn't have Maybe thought so. Maybe a hundred. Maybe, but 
Maybe Harry, maybe Harry this year, maybe. but <laughs> in round four. 21. <laughs> Never I mean, know, it, Harry, Harry's got the talent. I mean, who's no. the closest to a 1,000 Look now? at this. There's this some footage of, uh, you can see, uh, this is right up there, so. Wow. And this is yeah, what he has to do. Hey, look at all it. The all the plastics trying to get their TikToks. Yeah, yeah look at them all. Yeah, they're probably, this is the only game they've ever been to. Yeah. <laughs> 100%, mate. Well, but one thing no, was awesome. So, Badwa. I reckon it was good. The only thing I'm going to say about it is, like, I think it should be done. We're big enough to do that. That's fine, man. There was really no danger. Of course, there's always a danger of something happening, but so be it. But um, the only thing is, if you notice when he's lining up for goals, right, look on the boundary. There's, like, a free security guard there. What I would have done is I would have had 20 security guards. Running towards Buddy. They should be lined up there ready. That's yeah. Wherever he was, they should just be there. That's yeah. your job. Yeah. And then soon as he kicks it, you all run onto the ground and surround him. That's Correct. the only thing I would have said. There was three security guards there. They, they were never going to stop the crowd, but let's try to protect him. That's the only thing I've got to say to him. But as far as the spectacle, it went around the world, man. Unbelievable. It's fantastic. And that famous head. Yeah, yeah. In front oh. of the, oh, the well, camera, it's mate, it's doing the rounds. Beta. That was a camera. That was, come on, mate. That was a camera, man. That was an earth fault. We'll, we'll get to that, that camera, later. Man. We'll get to that later. But yeah, so that was, a, well, that was a special moment, man. As I said, I've seen the Lockett do it. I've seen Dunstall. A, Dunstall do it. I've Ablett. seen Ablett do it. I've seen Kip. now this one. And Kip. I've also Kip. seen the 100 goals yeah. three or four times, you know. So, uh, so that Incredible. is pretty special, yeah. So fantastic. No, no, definitely keep it Cheers up. Let's you, not. Yeah, yeah, no, he's an absolute champion. He's an absolute Super champion. Star. There was uh, there the big great Alex Clarkson with the. Oh with yeah, the... he had a little great northern on him, yeah. sinking yeah. a great northern, slamming it down uh, the hatch. Yeah, really loving it. So that was good. That was good. All right. What do we got next? Yeah, we're talking about next. Mars's. Malachio. Malachio. A clown freaks me out. It's because I am a clown. <laughs> well, seriously. I reckon little kids are scared and run away. <laughs> Good. How can they be scared of this? No, guy? not him, the clown. He, that's his him. Oh, that is me. That's yeah, a photo. I'm in the suit, there. Right? <laughs> oh, well, this what one, do we got? What do we got This today? one's irked me for a lot of years. What is it? A lot of oh, years, yes, yes, a yes, lot yes, of, yes, like, yes. always oh, say it, yeah. always. Yeah. People that, all right, so if you go to a Carlton game, Western Bulldogs, just for example, I saw a few people there on the weekend, oh, on the weekday, sorry, wearing other teams' colours. <laughs> now, just listen here, you fucking idiot. <laughs> <laughs> if you're going to an opposition game that no teams are playing, you don't have to wear a fucking Essendon scarf, a Collingwood beanie. I uh, saw it. It was a Hawthorne uh, scarf. I saw it. I I've about seen. The I've even seen like an Essendon jumper. Yeah. Now the urge that goes through me, I want to go there and just <laughs> king hit him. Yeah, but I can't. Yeah. Or him or no, we, we don't we promote don't no violence. king hitting. No, no. But it's tongue in cheek. Seriously, yeah. just leave it at home. Go wear your jeans, your bullshit top. And wear some other, maybe buy a big freeze beanie. I agree. And wear that. Yeah, hundred yeah. percent agree. Why are you wearing it other looks teams' so colours? Weird. It's dumb. It looks stupid. When you see him, it's dumb. Yeah. When you see it, you're just like, what are you doing? All right, so you follow that other team. Why are you wearing it to the? Why are you it's just to dumb. No, no, it's just. It dumb. irks me. Yeah, it does. If irk. I was to go to a game like that, and my mates didn't tell me, bro, why are you wearing those colours for? Like if it was GWS versus Richmond. Bro, why are you wearing right, those colours right. for, man? Oh, I'd support the team. Yeah, yeah. what team? They're not Don't playing. Don't support their team. Get out of here, mate. So just yeah. keep your shit at home. <laughs> can I just add to that? Pl- yeah, go, go. You can add to it. If you're oh, over sixteen oh, yeah. and you oh. put face paint on, okay, seriously, yeah. and seriously. you wear a jersey over well, eighteen, you you wear the jersey. Hands, look. I don't know, that's my mm. other, I don't like it. But you don't do the Guernsey, you. that's because you yeah. don't deserve no, to. Yeah, no, I, feel like, I love that. That's, you feel that's like, a great If year. you're like 10, 12 years old, whatever, yeah. who cares? But once, you, dream. Get, once yeah. you get to 18, 19, you understand what yeah. it's about. Take yeah. it off, mate. Yeah. Take it off. And But the face pain? 
Oh. I can't understand, mate. I see them, they paint their faces, grown men, mate. Grown men. Mate, we're gonna turn Children into and Kane women. Corns. And we're going to turn into Kane Corns, the fun police. <laughs> yeah, we are the fun no, police. Come yeah. on, man, fun police. Come on, I'm saying have as Actually, much fun speaking, as you I've want. I've got a few things in the work with uh, Cornsy. Have you? Yeah, I'll get, I'll, uh, could be next week's show, I'll, uh, I'll show Have you? Yeah, a few things the in the corn. work. The corns. Yeah, a few oh, things I in like the work it. with the cane stuff. I like it, I That's like it, I like it. All right, done. let's do one of our favourite segments, Banana, Banana of, of the, the Week. week. All right, all I love right. this segment. Oh, this is the one. best. Can I uh, start? You're going to get the banana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, keep forgetting about the banana, Go, go, go. This is a banana of the week, man. We this always goes. forget it. Can't forget Can the banana. Can we have a look at the first picture? Yeah, yeah let's man. go. This goes, first of all, yep, 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 yep. to Marvel Stadium. Okay, right. To the sexy scoreboard. Okay. Now, everyone can see it, right? Yes. Yeah. It's huge, huh? It, it, well, it's, it's long. Well, yeah. it's, it's, it's huge. It's, it's huge. It's not that big. It's big enough. Right. And what they do is, they put... Adds on a third of it, and the score on the other, and then it's just as big as the other scoreboard. He's right. Look, we had this massive thing, and I couldn't see a thing. I couldn't see anything, mate. The only time they used the full score, the, the full board, was when the doggies kicked the gun. There was a stupid dog. <laughs> what is that? Use the whole scoreboard, mate. Put the ad. I can only say put the ad. Okay. On the side. Look how much room there is on the side. There's nothing there. Put the ad on the side, right? The the score, you can put on the other scoreboard and let's have a big picture. Far out, mate. That's <laughs> yeah, shit. Rocco's ramp part three. Yeah. <laughs> Rocco. But I've got another one. <laughs> banana. Another banana. Oh, yes. Doggies, what do you do all week? That's the best you can come up with. The mullet can. <laughs> that's your entertainment. That's your. That's why you're a rabble of a club, mate, because that's the best you can do with your bloody entertainment. Mullet cam. I'm, I'm, what is wrong with Australia and their entertainment? They've they got no idea. Their, their entertainment is the worst in the world. I'm telling you, Marvel and their perfect partners, Marvel and the doggies, <laughs> Because you get one big banana for both of us. <laughs> Beautiful. Alright. I'm gonna end this, so it'll be a good end. Oh, you wanna go? Okay, you, you got one? Yeah. yeah. I've got a good one. I've got a great one here. <laughs> FBS and the football club. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I went and watched I went as a neutral fan. Well oh, did you? Not a neutral fan because I wanted the Brisbane Lions <laughs> to win by eighty five goals. I love right? it, I love it. But let me just take they are Mate, they are garbage. They are garbage. They are garbage, it's mate. It's the best. Mind you, I just hope in a couple of rounds they don't come out and play the game of their lives against us, which is yeah, probably yeah. what usually yeah. happens with them. Mm -hmm. Nah, there's still ages to go, isn't Mate, it? they are... Oh, they, were, 13. they were bad, man. They were bad. They'll be ready for relegation by around 13, mate. So, <laughs> a nice little, a nice little oh, early barb that's to the nice Bombers. Shot. That's a nice Just because I was at the game and, you a know, nice close shot. mate who's a mad Brisbane supporter. Yeah, I'm and telling that. you, man. It's all worn out. It's all worn out, mate. <laughs> no, they never, never wore in. They never, never wore in. Have you noticed Hurdy's lost all that tan too, Has mate? That was from that. Well, all right, Marzi, let's go. Dirt and it could be. Oh, oh no, you can't give it to little so chicha dirt. He had three statless quarters and he had one good quarter. I can I'm hear, not going to go I can there. hear Terry. No, I'm can't. not going to go Heart there. Beating. I'm not going there. Terry's up my turn. Terry. Terry. Terry's absolutely chucked the bloody flu. So, well, not calm going down. to Durden. No, we're not going to give it to him. Could go to Port Adelaide because they're absolutely shit they're out. They're garbage. But then maybe they were a little bit underdone. So we'll leave that. We'll leave him. Leave him. Leave him. But if you witnessed on uh, Friday night there <laughs> at uh, the SCG, Buddy's goal. Beautiful. Beautiful. 85,000 people running onto the floor. <laughs> Going to the ground, sorry. It's a beautiful sight. Yeah, it's not the COVID protocols anymore. No, no, no. The H&S no. protocols. Security guards have to wear Doesn't exist. Doesn't, Doesn't exist. exist. No, but security guard has to wear it. What got me? What got me? Is Channel 7's coverage right here? You got a microphone? 
Yeah, let me just <laughs> point at that. <laughs> let me point at that. That's all I saw interviewing Buddy. Oh, yeah. Here we go. He's but. I'm like, why are you still got this this fucking pole for? There's been a million people on the on the pitch. They're all crowding him. They're spitting on him. They were jerking him and doing this and that. Rubbing his hair. Like, like, I don't know who was Richo. interviewing him. Richo. Richo. He's here from here, eh? I'm like, come on, man. And then after the interview, you know what he did? He went up to him and he shook his <laughs> I'm like, what's going on here? So, and, and mind you, the camera placement as well of Channel oh. 7, the ribambita that got up in front of the camera with the fucking head. Mate, it ruined the sporting moment and iconic. Best. So everything to do with Channel 7, I don't give a shit how much you pay this bullshit in the AFL. It was shit. That Your was coverage shit. was shit. <laughs> everything was shit. Your COVID was shit. 1.5 metre pole. So you can shove it up your what? ass and get the biggest banana of the week. <laughs> Fuck you. I think what, that's a, a, what a banana this week. It shit me. Done. It absolutely shit me. We just attacked everyone. Marvel Channel <laughs> 7. Like Western Bulldogs. We're going to get a call from Gil this week. Right. Shove his Boys, sexy. Boys, just tone it down. Come on. <laughs> hey, write in the comments, does anyone disagree with any of them? They can't be. They can't if be. If you do, come here and talk to me there. 100%. <laughs> and you're right too. This... This 1.5. See, scrap it. Oh, it didn't need to be done, but that's it. And you're right. They shake their hands. He, and he then, shook his hand. And then it's like... Come on. Optics, yeah. they optics. It's all bullshit. Anyway. Uh, I don't want to get into right. this chat because nah. I'll start to get furious. Yeah, Next. You know what? Furioso Bananas be coming into the rain. <laughs> I, <don't, yeah. laughs> I told you, mate. It's the little red tin banana, mate. It's getting angry. It's, it's, getting angry. it's the little red you know what's banana. Good? You know what's good? What? We're not getting angry at Carlton. Exactly. We're yeah. angry <laughs> For at once. Everything else. else. You wish you were like Carlton. All right. Hey, listen. Let's have a little bit of a relaxation here. Relaxation. And do a little bit of talking blue with Rocco and our good friend Vince. And w that is proudly sponsored by the Melbourne Coffee, Coffee Roasting, Roasting Company. Mr. Lochisano doing a great job uh, oh, uh, with the talking job. blue and uh, Brandon... Uh, Baby Lacqua. Baby Lacqua, thank Charles you very much. On the much coffee train. Thank you very much. Charles this week we thank look you. at the 1986 semi final between Carlton and Hawthorne. Ooh. So let's have a look at that. Thanks. We are the Navy Blues. We are the old dark Navy Blues. We're the team that never lets them down. We're the only team old Carlton knows. All right, guys, welcome to another episode of Talking Blue with Rocco and Vince. How are you, mate? Good to see you, mate. Very you well? good. So where are we today? We're at the wonderful H Cafe in High Street, Thornbury, which is owned by the one and only Terry yeah. and Helen Degani, yeah. parents of Terry Degani <laughs> from Blue Abroad. So yeah. we thought we'd uh, come and on Helen, So they call it a H but it's called that because we've got the big H there, <laughs> haven't we? The we big have. H. Big Harry Mackay? That's the one. Or is it Mackay? Mackay. Yes. It's Mackay. It is Mackay. Mackay. So here we're just on the eve of... They make a very good coffee. Melbourne Roasting, um, Coffee Roasting Company, exactly, by the way. Exactly, mate. Very good. They give them the beans, they put it in the machine, and then they make the coffee for us. That's right. So we're going to go back in time today to a famous second semi-final back in the mid-1980s where we really put our best foot forward against yeah. the Hawks who tormented us for years. Yeah, yeah. And um, it was a, a fantastic game and uh, we're going to look back on some highlights from the 1986 second semi-final. Yes, we are. At, and in that period of time, it was... Uh, the Hawks and the Blues and the Bombers were up there at one stage. They were great rivalries back in those great days. Great rivalries yeah. there. And this is one of the 
one of the two years where Hawthorne and Carlton. Three years in a row. Well, three years. 86, 87 and 88. Yeah. Carlton and Hawthorne played the second semi-final. Yeah, second semi-final. And the winner went straight into the grand final and had a right. week's rest. That's right. So that was that. These are one of the two years that we made the grand final. Yes. And so we play them in this uh, in this grand final. Where did we... Do you remember where we finished that year on the ladder? Um, it wasn't first. It wasn't first. I think that we were was about in, third or something like yeah, that. Yeah. In 87 we finished first. Yeah. But in 86, but we're right up there and we get to this stage and we need to uh, naturally We might have been second on the way last year, home and away. And we come, and so let's have a look at some highlights. Yep. So let's start with, before we look at these highlights, first quarter was a bit of a... Yeah, it was a good contest. Yeah. Yeah. We went in uh, with a three-point lead, I think, in, in, uh, at the yep. time. Four goals, four to four goals, one. Yeah. Then they got the first couple of the second quarter. Yeah. And then we fought back. At each of the changes, we always managed to keep our noses in front. I think we might have had a four-point lead, sorry, three-point lead at quarter time, a nine-point lead at half time, and an eight-point lead at three-quarter time. Something yep. like that. We're always about a goal, a goal and a yep. half. Yeah. So front. let's have a look at these highlights. So what we can do is we'll start it here, and it starts at the second quarter. Played at Waverley, of course. The Played old, at Waverley. The old Waverley Park. Remember driving to Waverley? Oh, it was a shocker. <laughs> mate, I, I'd have to take That's off. terrible. I used to have to take off two days to get there and back, mate. It was like a holiday, man. I never went further than that on my holidays those days, you know. So. How about trying to get out? Oh, trying to get out. Once I the lost Waverley Car Park. That oh, Adelaide uh, preliminary, was it? Yes. Yeah, I lost my car, couldn't find it for four <laughs> hours. I was on the wrong Are side of the ground. This? No, that was the second semi. The that second was in 93. 93. Yeah. I lost it and I could not find the car. It, I didn't care. <laughs> I didn't care because we had a good day that day. But, yeah, that's right. But That was I, the one where Harry Madden kicked yeah, that running goal. Yeah, one day we'll talk about that. Yeah, yeah, we will. Big Harry, big Harry. So here we are in the second quarter. Let's get this going. Yeah. Here's some. There's Peter Motley, number two. Now it's we get to see. see we get to oh, see. Oh, look, look at Jono. Jono. Hey, that remind me of Chris. The ultimate finals player. Look at this. Look at this man. So yeah. we're gonna get there. He's That's he was Johnny supposed Platten. to. He was supposed to come to go. But no, look at this. Johnny Platten. There's look the, at the there's players. English. Desi. Yes. Desi English. Bradley. Desi this English. was the first year that we had all the South Australians come over. Kernahan, right. Bradley, Motley. Uh, we had uh, Bernie Evans come across oh, from Sydney. Oh, look at Big, Big Sellers. Hey, look at that. That oh, was the ground. That was by Bernie Evans. Out of midair. That's right, Bernie yeah, Evans. Yeah, look at that. What Kick a, great, a goal. What a great player Bernie Evans was. Look at that came crowd across. those days. I loved it. Do you know we actually kicked five goals in this game? Yes, yes, he had a really good game here. Look had at a this. really good There's Peter Motley. Look at Motley, he, mate. Look he, at the way. Look at that. Oh. Poetry in motion. You're going to see a bit of him today. Yep. And there's Warren McKenzie, number 45. We're going. There's English. Yes. So. It's in good here flow. We go. He, was, he the, was the best man on best the ground, David right. Reese Jones. Over to he wasn't far off at Johnson. Look oh, at this guy. Look at that. Mate, he was running back look before he that. kicked it. He knew that was going through. What a finals player nah, he was. A eh? champion. Look at this Didn't man. Didn't he really perform under under pressure in finals? Mate, I get excited just saying his name. <laughs> look at this. Look at the big six. Six turn of hand on uh, Chris Mew when he takes the mark. Look at him. This is a young. Look at him. Look at him. 23-year-old Stephen Kernahan. Comes from Glenelg. Oh, look at that. That was Alvin. Yes. This is such a good play. Oh, There's Peter Dean. Peter young, Dean, a young, young Peter Dean. Dean. And over to Bradley, look at the pace to burn, Bradley. Look He's, how young he was. He was roving all day, Bradley. Over Here to go. Bernie Evans. Here we go. Here Another we go. Watch this, watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Oh, and of course, Mark McCool was our captain that year. Yes, he was. He was the captain. Only for the one year. Only for the one year, yeah. Here he goes. He goes back. He looks at the goal. Look at this goal, mate. Hey. Split the centre. Mate, Salas says he was good, but you know what? He was. <laughs> he was very good. He was a good... Gave you a contest yeah. every oh, look at Big Harry, mate. He freaks me out how young yeah. he looks there. Yeah. Look at Dave, him. Now, David Reese jones is clearly the best on the ground. B-A-G, mate. B-A-G. Clearly the best on the ground. B-A-G. Oh, yeah, he got hit. copped it there. Terry Wallace. That Mangrel. was David Terry Wallace. Mangrels. Terry Wallace. <laughs> There's look Bernie him. Evans again. Mate, he was, he was a star that day. He was a great Evans. player that day. Here we go! Oh, oh big turn of hand takes the mark. Takes the big screamer. It was a love great it. mark. Love it. I love watching this footage. Look at this man. He goes back. Great memories of this. a great Oh, player. that was the it day. It was a really good contest this game. We've seen Carlton's best highlights, but 
the whole game was no, just no, the top. Whole game. You know, it was real seesawing battle. But we don't really give a shit about going into the time on period of the last quarter. We only had a one point lead, so yeah. it all came down to that time on period in the yeah. end. Yeah. Here's Kernahan lining it, up it. that classic. It didn't change, didn't change. Classic look. He's one of like through the middle. 700 and how many goals? 38. 38 goals. 738 look goals. Look at the Blues, mate. Fantastic. Oh, there's Big a Derby. Big, there's Big Dorothy, and she came across too yeah. from Western Australia. We had some good. Look at he this. was a watch great player. Watch the defence here. Oh, Brucey Dool. That's Hamzy. Look at him. I look at Bruce Dool and Harms. They haven't got a hair between them. <laughs> you see that? Look at this, mate. Uh, look at that flying door, mate. No, what a great player. Man, this was, was his last year. Yeah, that was his last. This year. is the second last game he ever this played. The second last game he ever played. There's Desi. Yeah, there's Desi. Over look, the and look at this, mate. He's got hair to burn. Yeah. Uh, David Reese Jones over the top. Oh, oh Fraser oh, Murphy! Fraser Murphy, he was a. Now, what? He was a little live wire in, um, in the forward pocket, was. but. He's like a little Durden. Unfortunately, in this game, Fraser actually got sprung hitting yes. a Hawthorne player, Johnny yeah. Platten. He did. And he actually got suspended he for did. one week, he and that out. meant missing out on the grand final. 100%, 100%, yeah. Which was a real blow for us, because he was a That's very the lively... Played, man. This almost reminds you of Carl. Look at this! Oh, While well, they're fighting, Kernahan's just kicked another one. How many did he kick that day? Six. I think he kicked three. Booty Evans got the most, he got five. He got five, that's right, he did too. Here's another one, Dual oh, and Dunstall. Oh, I love that! Dual played well on Dunstall ah, this time. Ah, Dunstall. But he, oh, I think Dunstall got his... Uh, got, got his, his revenge bacon. in the grand final. In the grand final. He final. kicked six on him. What a scumbag. Yes, that's when scumbag. you knew it was uh, yeah. time time to hang up the boots, Bruce. It's probably the only time he ever bet him. But look, in fairness, the boots are coming that's, down all day. Look at him, that was Motley. Too. Do you see Motley? Yeah. The way, mate, I'm telling you, man. You, man. Here we go, look at this, what this tap oh, on. Oh, McClure, well done, over that little Fraser Murphy, look at those little legs running up and down like pistons, like oh, engine know, pistons. Man. That was sick, man. That was absolutely unreal. Look yep. at this there, what's this little bit of play here, what's this? Here's tap. Dora. Oh, there's Motley again, mate. I'm mopping up man, at the back. He would have been anyone that had to see, this stuff. is actually a privilege of watching this, because oh, there yeah. was, there's not that much footy jobby. No. I'm telling you, the, the bloke was a machine. He's uh, Here we Robertson. Go. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Oh, oh Dora. He played well on Britain that year. Very good. Here he goes. Look at this. All their contests in 1986, I think Dorothy's had the better of him. Yeah. Here we go. Look, he was everywhere. He was. Yeah. Little Fraser. Look at this. Watch Great little small four. There's Bernie Evans. Bernie Evans, he played a good game. There too. you go. Now, imagine having Fraser Murphy and Bernie Evans in your yeah. forward line. Yeah. Yeah. Young Corey Durden and uh, Matty Owies, you've got a yeah. long way to go. <laughs> yeah, no, no, wow, but hey, they started well, so got to be happy with them. Yeah, look, he's got the two goals at this stage, Bernie. Hey, look at this. He really this, fired up in hey, the last quarter. I reckon this will go straight through. Watch this, watch this, watch this, watch this. Oh, Thank you. Oh, yes. And the umpire does not move. Love it. Love it. I used to love the goal umpire in, in the white coats yeah, and the white hat. Nah, that was Don't you traditional. remember those days? Yeah, no, nah, it was good, though. Peter Dean, Peter Dean, over to Dooley, Desi English, of course Desi. Oh, that was a big hit. That hit. Hey, that's a Meldrum. Yeah, Molly, Meldrum. over to Harmsy, look, look at him go, look at him go. Look how quick he is, I mate. love him, and this I is love Wayne He was Hart. like 48 years old then, man. <laughs> no, he's not. The bloke <laughs> was a champion, oh, it was at the end of his career. Look at Murphy, Here he back goes. to Meldrum. Meldrum. Over to Jono. And he slams oh, it home for another one. Look at this one, and he's pumped and he's too. Pumped. Look at yeah, he is, you can tell, look. I love it, look at this bloke, man, I want that hat. <laughs> I want that hat, look at this, John again. That was a again. great bit of play. Oh, the, look at young Sosa. Look at Stephen Silvani. Could you believe? That was And there's Bernie that. Evans got, gets his fourth. Can you believe they dropped Stephen Silvani for the grand final? Oh. And he kicked something like eight goals in the reserves did, grand final. He did too. And he, he, did and he too. absolutely he stuck the middle too. finger up to the selectors that though. He did too. Here he goes again, man. There's Mots again. Over to Reese Jones. Yes. You've got all the time in the world. Look how skinny Bradley. these blokes are, mate. What happens after footy, man? Now, they there just we go. go. Eat for fucking days. Now we're 13 points in front. We've already kicked two goals in the there time. He goes. Oh, he loved and it. And here comes the third one. He loved it. Did oh, he? he was fantastic, little Fraser Murphy. This is right Where the, num yeah, the number 30 was pride. He did too, he did too. 
He did too. Look at this. And here, here we, we go. go. This is probably towards the end, I think. This is towards the end. Oh, There's Kernahan. He's playing down. He's playing down the middle there. Over to Glasgow. Oh, Glasgow. Another Back champ. Back to yeah. Kernahan. What and are you doing here? <laughs> oh, there's little goes. Fraser Murphy That's again. That's a good call. <laughs> In the right position. I love that. That was man. a great game of football. Fantastic game of footy from us. I there's one you. more to go. Here Just go, when you thought it. it was all over. No, we is. dominated this time on period. Kicked four goals to nothing. And that was the thing, man. From like, time on. From time on. And here and we look, go. And look, the crowd's running on the ground. The siren's hey, gone. This, this used to be, I know that it everyone... Is. <laughs> people on the ground everywhere. I love this. And he kicks it too. He kicks it. And people talk about pressure these days. Oh, you know, like he said something to me. There was people running all over the place there, mate. And he kicks the goal. He kicks the goal. Yes. So, so that, fantastic. That was a great our game of football. I was just absolutely stoked with that performance. No, 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 of course, man. Looking forward to a grand final. We had a week off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hawthorne had to play Fitzroy yeah, the following yeah. and week. And we hadn't made the grand final for, uh, I know it was only like four, no, four years. years. Yeah, but still, those days there, four years was a long time. <laughs> Can you believe it? We say, oh, we hadn't made a grand final in four years. I'm telling you. <laughs> we take one every four years now, It was we? bad, mate. I'm telling you, we were like... That was the expectation. Then. We couldn't believe it that we weren't making finals in 83, 84, 85. Well we, well we made it in 79 we won the premiership. Yeah. 80 we were a couple of games off the grand final after finishing on top of the ladder. Yeah. 81 we made the grand final and won. 82 we made the grand final and won. And 86 and 87 we made the grand yeah. finals. It was that 83, 84, 85 period we finished about fifth, yeah. fourth, fifth. Yeah. But that's it. But we still made the finals. We still made the finals, and, and at that stage there, Hawthorne and Essendon were really dominating. They were dominating, and we 85. we needed that rebuild. That's yes. why. That's when we got the sticks. We got Motley. We got Bradley. But not only that, we got a new coach. No, no. We, we swapped coaches from Parkin, who'd been at Carlton for five years. Yeah. Won two premierships in his first two years, but then he was coaching us through that period of '83 to '85, where we were yeah. just making the finals, but never really a threat. Yeah. And uh, yeah, so they made the move to swap with Fitzroy. Yeah, they did. He got the, the old former Carlton champion Robert Walls back. They did the swap. And, and Parker went to Fitzroy. And Fitzroy played in the preliminary final the week after here. Yeah. Unfortunately, they got beaten by Hawthorne. Which unfortunately for, for, for Parker. Mm -hmm. But uh, then mm -hmm. Hawthorne, of course, got their revenge on us in the 86 grand final, unfortunately. That's it. But, That's it. but that second semi final performance was brilliant. Yeah, no, that was an excellent performance. Hawthorne so obviously his... did their homework after that. Oh, 100%. So we won't talk about the week after, no. but we got them back in 87. <laughs> Don't worry about that. We got them back in 87. Yeah, yes. so that was on the eve. That is on the eve of... Uh, Another Carlton Hawthorne performance coming up this week. Hopefully yeah. we can get over the line against those mongrels. 100%, man. You can see them nah. brown and yellow and in, rubbish. in those 80s. Come on. But every year they felt like making the grand final. The piss and shit jumpers, that's what they are, mate. Let's be serious, let's be serious. All right, that yes. was great. Good going back in time to look at games like that. 100%, that was, that was great. All right, man, thank you very much. And we'll see you great for the see, next mate. episode of Talking Blue. We'll be willing to go Blues! Go Blues! All right, guys, how is that? The slice mate? of culture has returned. And yeah, uh, a shout out to uh, the guys at H Cafe. H Terry, Terry's parents doing a great job yep. there. Uh, go support Harry. them. And Helen? Yep. Correct. Correct. The H's. The H's. The yep. H's, mate. Beautiful cafe. Everyone go down there. It's on High Street, Northcote. Correct. I can't remember what number. And Terry's mum, mate. She's a sick puppy with the blues. Oh, mate. She's wild. As soon as I got there. Yeah, mate. Right? As soon as I got there, she... I said, listen, I've got to record because she's just kept talking about the blues. But she loved <laughs> I love it. it. It's good. She loved it, man. So I now understand where Terry gets I it think from. She, no, she's more sick than Terry. I'm telling you, yeah, she loved it, man. Terry. She loved yeah, it. And she awesome. knows everything, man. And the food there, we ate a meal. Quality. The coffee. I'm telling you, everyone go down to H. Hey, and you know why it's called H. H. Yeah. Why? Because the parents said H. H. Aren't they? Nah, that because, right? oh. because of Big Harry Mackay, mate. Oh, okay, right, the yeah. Big H, mate. Right, okay. Big H, yeah. There you H go. is oh, everywhere. H is everywhere. Triple hey, H. listen. Let's go into this segment. <laughs> che bello! Ma che cazzo sta a fa? Ma che cazzo sei? Ma che cazzo vuoi? Ma che cazzo vuoi? Fatti cazzo, ci vuoi? Ma!
Kekäs! Fala a verdade aí que tá você tá voando. Você tá voando. Mas que cacho está bem de novo? Eu não sei o que eu estou fazendo. 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 You could say, like a cat, or you can say, like, like a cat, you know, like a cat, you know, like there's a million ways, it depends on how you say it. Hey, listen, last week we saw a great joke, and I promised we would see yes. the next joke. Bob Hawk, so let's have roll the clip, let's have roll the clip. So I'll just tell you a story, which is also a boating story, which captures the Australian irreverence. There's three blokes. <laughs> Some of you have heard the story, but it just captures the thought. Three blokes, a Frenchman, an Englishman, an Aussie. And uh, hiking in the Andes in the middle of summer, it's about 45 bloody degrees. <laughs> Sweating like pigs, they get to the top of this mountain, they look down, and there's this most beautiful, pristine lagoon. They go scrambling down the side of the mountain, get their gear off and dive in. Oh, bloody marvellous. The natives come and grab them. Taking the chief, the chief says, you have broken most sacred law. <laughs> this is our most sacred site. For this you die. When we kill you, we take off skin. Out of skin, make canoes. Put canoes on lake. Permanent reminder all people, never infringe our most sacred site. Tie them up. <laughs> they tie them up, he says, says the Frenchman. Before you die, you have one last wish. What's your last wish? He said, uh, I, I, would, um, I, I would like a knife. So they bring him knife. He says, I, I'm not going to die at the hands of you savages. Vive la France. <laughs> and over he goes. <laughs> then he says to the Englishman, What's your last wish? Mm, you like my friend from across the channel. I too would like a knife. Uh, bring him a knife, and he says, Me like my friend from across the channel. I too am not going to die at the hands of you savages. Go and save the queen. <laughs> <laughs> then say to the, the Aussie, on your last wish, he said, I want a fork. <laughs> <laughs> so they bring him a fork, and he goes, <laughs> There goes your canoe. <laughs> <laughs> What an icon! How good is it? He's an oh, icon. Well, we don't have politicians like that anymore. Nah. They don't he, exist. He's a John Elliot. Of, he's just oh, yeah, he's unbelievable. Of the Prime Minister of, the of Australia. Australia. And John Elliot was going to be, oh, while well, he was uh, the head of his uh, electoral party at the time, wasn't he? Well, they were uh, opposing poli yeah, political right. parties. But, but uh, Bob, what a man! One man and there's plenty more of where they come from. So Love his racing. Huh? He owned a horse called uh, Bal de Jour, who won oh. a golden slipper, which was one of the most famous wins because it missed the start by three lengths and oh. stormed home. And Train uh, Clary Connors, John Singleton was yes. in it. Yeah, so, so and he loved his sport. Loved his sport. Not like the mama look we've got now, man. He pretends to wear the scarf to the thing, man. Or is it a rugby or something? Yeah, yeah. Cronulla. Yeah. Remember when we won the America's Cup? Oh, if any if anyone sacks <laughs> their worker today for taking a day off their he above. loved it, man. Yeah. He loved it so, yeah. and he drank a beer, and he still drank that bloody. Nectar. He still holds the record, doesn't he, for a yard of beer? Does he? Yeah. What is it? A yard of beer. Uh, the quickest time to drink a oh, yard really? of beer. It's one of those big oh, glasses like me? that. Bang. I'm not telling you, it's a gunk. Hey, listen. You know how things have changed in the world, right? I have. Let's have a look at an ad from. No. This proof comes from the latest report just received covering a full 16 months. And it comes from a doctor who's been examining a group of Chesterfield smokers as part of a program supervised by a responsible independent research laboratory. Now after a full year and four months, the doctor reports again no adverse effects to the nose, throat, or sinuses from smoking Chesterfields. Now, don't you want to try a cigarette with a record like this? Chesterfield. That was the norm. Now, That's, uh, the people yeah. who done that report are the same people who done the vaccine for the COVID. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, no. Attacking them on all fronts. <laughs> oh, no. oh, well. 
That was a good, good why, good why. Hey, listen, I just got some footage of the doggies game and how it how it all unfolded. Unfolded. Yeah. Let's have a look at this. All confident here. All confident. All confident. Kerno. Oh, 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 oh my god! Right, here we go, McKay. <laughs> here we go. Here we go. It's third quarter. Look at this. Avoid it. No worries, mate. We're in business here. Oh, <laughs> oh wait, wait, wait. Come on, now. Nah. One more go. We can have one more go. Oh, oh, oh that's it. He's out. <laughs> Ah, ah. Just the poor little kid. <laughs> that was the doggies, right? Oh, <laughs> wow. Hey, listen. Hey, listen. You know, in our days, when we were kids, I like, get there, like... Your days? or well, like, my days, okay, you know, yeah. like, the family dynamics, the household was different to what it is now. Yes, def definitely. There was an interview on the street. Have a look at this one. Would you tell me, please, who is the boss of your house? I'm the boss. What do you think? You're his wife, are you? <laughs> what did you say? I said, who is the boss? Who is the boss? My of husband. <laughs> what is your nationality? Greek. I'm Greek. Is it always that way in Greek households? The husband is the boss? Yes. Don't the women, the wives, have anything to say about it? No. <laughs> <laughs> Who's the boss? See that? And you know what I love the best bit? Where he goes... Talk, talk, talk. Like you said, something, say something, say something. You know, like, yes. Uh, that's and look how, how happy they were. Yeah, yeah. No, look how happy they were. That's different now. Imagine that now. Who's the boss? You would not dare answer that in public, right? Yeah, but it's amazing how, like, those, that generation, they all stayed intact and together. Yeah, of and the family was the... Yeah, of course. The family was the pinnacle of, of everything. Course. And now... Oh, we've got to do this and do that. And the yeah. divorce rates, never, you know, people can't fucking, you know, it's just, it's, it's, different it's a different, times, world. Different, it's a different times, different world. It's a different world. It's a different world. Different times, bro. Different. different it's times. a different, different world. Hey, listen, Tom Morris. Oh, oh God. God. No. He's back. Oh, no, he's back. Is he, he got a job. Did he? Oh, yeah. Where? Let's have a look. Want to get bitten? Because okay. <laughs> uh, Seven lost, which is mine. Jill, Jill. Not Jill. Megan. Okay. Maggie. Maggie. Yeah, we have right? this one. <laughs> he was a presenter. Who yeah. for, Channel 9? I don't know who it was, but you play with fire, yeah, you get oh, burnt up. Mate, they had to break the claw. claw, claw. Don't they, they grow back? Yeah. 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 Okay. No, nah, but that one there, that's going so, that's into someone's <laughs> plate. <laughs> <laughs> so growing back for nobody, mate. Do you, anyway, listen. You get caught talking on camera, you end up working at Victoria Market, with fucking selling bloody crabs. <laughs> All right. Ah, what's this last one? Let's have a look at this last one. Now, Don Quixote here just folded like a little girl. But Baldy, still weighing it up. <laughs> oh, shit. What do you think? What are the eggs? Good or bad? Did he call you Baldy? Yeah. <laughs> Baldy. That was a series called The New Gold Mountain on Channel 2. It was a three part series. It was about the the Chinese when they came down uh, and the gold, the gold oh, rush okay, and how they nice. were yes, 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 yes. about their um, time down here. Yeah. Okay, well, so well. I played a small part in that, as you can see. Nice. Baldy. Nice. There you go. Known as Baldy. <laughs> Huh? Just crack him off air or? Yeah. yeah good. good. <laughs> Let like him have that. it. And then after that. A bit of cribs. Yeah, no. I'll give me, that's it. I gave a little bit of cribs in there. So there you go. And there is. Ma. Ma get cats. I get cats. Another big one. All right. <laughs> We've come up to the. Look at it. <laughs> you want to put that away? Because let's go into. Paul's call. C 
So, ben, no, ben, I'm not even going to say anything. Because, benvenuti. Uh, yeah, benvenuti, <laughs> mate. Last week. Welcome. Last week was uh, was uh, just the next level, mate. That was uh, magnificent. Well, you know, like, all you can do is try. Yeah, all you can do is all try. Well, that's why you got the, uh, the job from the AFL now. Just well, I think to... they saw that, geez, you know, he's just such an inclusive and multicultural driven <laughs> human. And he's got so much talent. At his disposal, that we we can't resist. That's it. We just can't resist. Yeah. So look, the, the Italian call was, oh, you know, it was magnificent. I man. think the Enjoyed catchphrase, it. una bomba. Oh, <laughs> just, just quietly, <laughs> there could be some merch coming out with a la bomba, mate. That was absolutely. I think we can. I reckon we can do something along those lines. No, no. Because the, I'm telling you, that could be the. You watch I midway gen- through the year. When Harry's kicking them from six <laughs> and bomba. everyone's going, Un bomba! I, I, gen- I genuinely don't know where that... Well, I do know where it... Like, it just... You just oh. see these moments and, like, you encapture them and, like, Big it bomb. just... It was the best, man. Yeah. It was absolutely... And everyone, if you want to see that, go over to the Jumper Punch uh, uh, channel and yes. we've got it up and please you can do. watch the please full do. one. Please but do. here please we do. go. What well, are we doing today? I'm going to... So... Last week's Italian call went off the rails and it was just, yeah, I think people were really getting around that. I don't don't think three quarters of the audience really understood what was going on. But you know what? I think, and I think this is true. It's like, you know when you listen to music in another language, but you don't really, like, you don't understand it, but you get it. Yeah. Yeah. You you know what's happening. Because, I mean, most most communication is done non-verbally. That's right. And that's what people pick up. So I think people sort of understood what was going on. So what I thought I would do for the punters again is... Another one? Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. You asked, we we deliver. We'll deliver. So this is the Italian call of the second quarter. All our goals in the second quarter. So I thought we'll start with the first, go to the end, and then... uh, It had to. Well, we just had that, to. That second quarter, it had to have a call there. Yeah, I know. Like, it just... So, anyway, we pick up the action. It's into the second quarter. And... Comincia il secondo tempo. Carlton contro Western Bulldogs. La palla nella 50 per Carlton. Crips, il capitano di Carlton. Crips, la mesa. Rete. Rete. Carlton in vantaggio. Carlton in vantaggio. Crips, il capitano. Allora, Carlton in pallone. Crips, ancora Crips, il mano da Fogari, always, ancora always, Mackay, il pallone per Mackay! <laughs> e lui possibilmente fa il tiragiro, tiragiro di Mackay! Rete, 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 il tiragiro! Rete! Ancora Mackay, ancora lui, e ancora lui! Carlton in vantaggio dai 20 punti, fiscia con il pallone per il re! <laughs> si dica il re, always, ancora always, vantaggio di Carlton, gol, 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 gol! Always la messa, always la messa, ancora Carlton per un altro gol, ancora Carlton per un altro gol, always la messa, il primo gol di lui, il primo gol di lui! Carlton in vantaggio da 26 punti, Clips, ancora Clips, il tempo fenomeno da lui, Deren con il pallone, da Fogari, Charlie Kernow, con la sinistra, ed è gol di Charlie Kernow, Charlie Kernow la messa dentro, Kernow con la sinistra, una bomba grande di Kernow, sì! Allora, Carlton con il pallone, dentro della 50, Kernow con il Mark, Adesso Kerno, c'è Mackay, c'è Always, Always, Mackay! Mackay con il rete, Mackay con il rete, e la messa dentro Mackay. Mamma mia che tempo di Carlton, il secondo tempo straordinario, straordinario di Carlton. Silvani per Crips, ancora lui, da Deren, Fischia! Il pescino, il pesce! Allora Fischia, piano piano si va lontano Fischia, rete, 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 11 gol per Carlton, 11 gol per Carlton, rete, Beveridge non sa che lui fa, Beveridge non sa che lui fa, rete di Fischia, allora Carlton con il pallone per Kennedy, Kennedy con la sinistra, Mackay, Mackay, Mackay! 
Non posso bastare lui! Makai con il tiro giro! Ancora la messa Makai! Il tiro giro la messa! Mamma mia! Che secondo tempo di Calton! Incredibile! Straordinario! Straordinario! Harry Makai è la messa! Harry Makai è la messa! Ed è gol di lui! Ed è gol di lui! That was a fair man! That was a fair man! Ed è gol! Ed è gol! I was ready for the, una bomba for oh, the Oh, una bomba! Far out. So great That was ball. sick man, I'm telling you! It brings e dopo a... tutto, dopo tutta la partita, yeah. Carlton ha vinto da... How much did we win by? 12 points. Da 12, 12, 12 punti. Da 12 punti. Da 12 punti. 2 a 0 per Carlton! 2 a 0 per Carlton! <laughs> E andiamo ragazzi! E andiamo! Sì! Everything mm? sounds better in Italian. It does. Bigger. Well done. And the multi, we'll know the result of it. Obviously not now because there's yeah, still a game in play going. Uh, but I'll be We're in waiting the, for one more later. I'll be in the office, I'll record the new multi and it'll go up right now. Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Paul's multi-segment on the Jumper Punch here in the Bet Deluxe offices. I'm uh, looking as sharp as I can for this segment as well because we landed a big multi on the weekend, last weekend. It was a Carlton at the line against the Doggies, Brisbane at the line against the Bombers, North Melbourne at the line against West Coast and Richmond at the line against the GWS Giants. So the jumper punch tally for Paul's multi is in the green and hopefully we can make as much profit as possible this year. Now, this weekend's multi, it's going to involve the Blues again, as it probably should always do. Carlton minus 17 and a half against the Hawks, so Carlton will need to win by 18 points or more. Melbourne at the line against the Bombers, which is minus 24 and a half, so the Demons need to win by 25 points or more. Geelong at the head-to-head, -head, so Geelong just need to win. And then Brisbane at the line against North Melbourne, which is minus 33 and a half. So the Lions need to win that game by 34 points or more. You'll get around about $10.50 to $11. Those are going to be the odds for that multi. And we're going to have $30 on it again for the jumper punch. So fingers crossed we can get this multi up and make it two from three for the year. But uh, to Justin Akari, Michael Marcucci as well, Chris Beach got around the multi too, so... Get on it this weekend, punters, and as always, make sure you gamble responsibly. And there's a the multi for this week. There's so a multi for this hopefully week. Hopefully it all gets up. Fingers Good crossed. We'll stuff, add the running mate. tally, the live tally down below, so hopefully we can add to the kitty. Good stuff, man. That was sick, man. I'm yeah, telling I'm, you, I'm man. It's going to be different. I'm telling you, man. Mate, the temperature goes up like 20 degrees My in here. Right? La mesa <laughs> then. Oh, I love it, man. Now I've got to go and translate it all for everyone. Yeah, now we're going to translate it. Eh, they're gone. Eh, they gone. <laughs> all right. Let's have a look at another champion in When We Were Kings. Great segment. Who wants to be king? Frazier was a huge favorite going into their fight in 1973. Under the Jamaican sun, Joe Frazier ran right into George Foreman like a Pontiac wrapped around an oak tree. That's how good George Foreman is in punching and in taking a punch. And Ali's trainer right next to me is saying it. You may hear him. Down goes Frazier! Down goes Frazier! Down goes Frazier! Corner! And he is as poised as can be. We have a minute left in this first round, and already this fight is proving out. The crushing power of George's uppercut lifted Frazier off his feet. After six knockdowns in just two rounds, there was a new champion. Over in the second round, George Foreman is the heavyweight champion of the world. After Ali's loss to Frazier, he goes on an eight-fight win streak. The referee may be deciding whether he's going to stop the fight. He is stopping the fight. Ali with a combination. Left uppercut, overhand right. 
Here comes the challenge. You're swinging wildly, pressing in. Oh, that right hand. The overhand right. I think he nailed it. But the showy elegance that once marked his style was fading. And he's taking no notice. This must be shown. The crowd whooping it up for Ali and whooping it up for Savannah. The blazing speed of hand and foot begin to wane. It was Quarry's last gallant effort. Referee must stop it. I was off for three and a half years, but now I'm back. I'm convinced. I'm cool. I'm ready. My wind is good. My weight's good. And I'm better than ever. And I want all of you to call that coward Joe Frazier out and quit fighting these has bins and start fighting somebody. Who's somebody? And how is that, mate, Ali, man? You can see then Frazier. You got uh, Foreman. He just knocks him With out, the mate. The get knocked down. Yeah, he gets knocked he gets down. Back up. To get back up, um, Ali comes back, wins his next eight after losing to Frazier, you know, and uh, he's not the same. He's, he's slowed down. It's like three years since he got, until he got, like, uh, the title taken away. He's come back. He's a bit slower. He's not as fast, but he's still... Still got the smarts. Don't yeah. worry. A wily that. old veteran. He's got it. He's got it. So he just goes in there, and now they're just getting ready for this big fight that's about to happen. I'm telling you, it's one of the best fights ever. Can't wait could to... Could be the best fight ever. Could be. Yeah. It could be. Man, it's fantastic. All right. All right. In closing, it's been a big show. It has been a massive show. <clears throat> Everyone, get on Instagram, TikTok, subscribe, like, and share right now. Hit it. Bang, yep. bang, Instagram, bang, TikTok, bang, Facebook, bang. all of it. YouTube. All of YouTube. Everything. Like, subscribe, follow, comment, Spotify. Do it all. Spotify. Go to Spotify follow now. Follow the Broad channel. Subscribe yep. to our new channel. Let's see the Spiro Cucamillas interview. I'm telling you, he's a funny bloke, man. And he tells us a couple of stories there about his contract yep. that you're not going to want to miss, man. The contract is funny, funny stuff about him and Colo. Bank. Oh. Yeah, because Colo okay. was the president at the okay. time. Okay, righty-o. Yeah, the big trader. Oh. Anyway. <laughs> Uh, everyone, let's get onto those buzz posters. Yep. They are now, they are all originally signed by the players. They're hand not signed. correct. They're not copies. Signed. They're, they're not photocopies. They're hand signed. And I'm telling you, you're not going to get them for the prices Every that they're print. selling to. Them. Either contact us or directly the buzz if you can, or get a hold of us and we'll get have a look at. Look at the one of Jezza and, and, um, and, uh, sticks. Correct. 25, 4, bang, both holding mate, their photos up. They're just... Huge. Mate, they're huge. These are two of the biggest players ever, and they get them signed up on your wall, mate. And that's it. And just remember, our two sponsors. Yep. Melbourne Coffee, Melbourne Coffee Roast. Roasting Co. Carlton 15 you're at gonna, checkout. You're going to suck the, the smell out of it. They're not going to taste of anything anymore. They're just going to be like... White beans. I love the smell of coffee. White beans are going to suck all the... <laughs> I love the smell. smell. If you don't drink coffee, there's something wrong with And we've got to big up Merino Bros, because I yes. think we forgot to mention We did in the, the, in the, the banana week. of the but week. But the thing will be down the no, bottom. We'll so Merino charged. Bros, we'll Merino just, Bros, we'll Merino charged. Bros. We'll charge. It was always up yeah. there, and it's up there now, as you can see. And That's also, it. went to see Con. The fruiterer. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. yeah. So let's see what he had to say this week. You know, I read in the paper the other day, this Mr. Blaney from the university, he said people, they should not vote if they not speak plain English. I don't know why he don't want to vote, but I can't understand a word he say. <laughs> Crazy, man. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I give you some of these for your boys and girls, your babies, your kids, come and they say you like eight of this, around. Beautiful. You know, I'll give you a few more. This one is it's full in the ground, but doesn't matter. It's still beautiful, lovely apple for your kid. <laughs> you know what's funny about him? When he used to go to weigh it, he put his, his hand down. <laughs> <out of there. laughs> so you pay more. You pay more there. Eh? <laughs> the best, eh? the best. So go down there. Either order, go down there, get your stuff. Double As I said, it's not just fruit and veg. No, they got everything. Pasta. They got everything. They actually got milk, cheeses. Yeah, yeah. They've got the whole Italian like uh, lineup. The yeah. lineup, everything in there, man. I'm Bang. telling you, they're the best, and we thank them for always jumping on board. Anyone else want to jump on board? Please contact us. Yeah. 
Contact direct us, message us. Direct message us. And we'll, we'll, we'll send you some details. Gmail.com. Yeah. Yep, you can email us or you can send us a message via our Facebook get page. Get on. Get and, on. Uh, be bang. part of the Jumper Punch. Be part of it. Yeah. If you want to be part and of it. And we can get bigger and better together. Correct. All right. We'd like to thank a few people. Now, this is going to be Rocco's Ramp Part 2. Okay. All right. Oh, wow. Jeez. Part 2. The first one. All right. First of all, I want to thank. This is going to be my rant. It's not so much of a rant. It's just a bit of a statement. Okay. All right. I'll tell you why. Just want to thank everybody, the viewers, the supporters, yep. messages, all the kind It's work. fantastic. Yep. It is <clears throat> absolutely amazing. When we first started this, it was about just, oh, let's get together, let's put a show out there and that. And then you want, uh, you want like, uh, likes and you want, like, don't get me wrong, that's important. It, it, that's important to us because it shows that we're doing the right thing. Yeah, exactly. That's what it's about, you know what I mean? So, so and it was all about that. But then in recent times, it's become more than that, right? And it's become amazing. And for example, last year's message from Byron Issa, he sent us the message about how much it means that what we do yeah. on a Tuesday. And there yeah. was the last week's message from Dean, was it Vaughan? Dean Vaughan. Dean Vaughan. Yeah, yeah. yeah, the one that About his mum. Yeah. Like I read that like, I that. like 20 just, times. So I couldn't know. believe it that like how much it meant to like someone else, you know? And then we mm. get like this one here from Andrew Baresi. Andrew Baresi. Baresi. The best of the best. My old man and I look forward to Tuesday night as much <laughs> as game day. Keep doing what you're Trace. doing. Ragazzi, we appreciate it all, all the best. Thank you, Andrew. Really that appreciate it. That makes sense, man. Thank like you. him and his old man, like they love it. Like, I'm not saying we bring people together, but I don't know. Like, I, it, what we've been doing is like, it, it's it's a bit like humbling. It's been like... Straordinario. Straordinario. <laughs> It's starting now. It people is. getting together, you know, and having a laugh, you know. And then there's this That's one what it's here all about. from Mickey D. The Jumper Punch, you're doing a massive job. Really appreciate the work you put in. You blokes have more of an influence on the club than you know. Look forward to the show every week. Let it rip into the filthy dogs. Of course. <laughs> but again, like people saying that we've got this influence on, on what the club is doing. Well, we all do. We all do. You know, we're fans. You know, and we're members. people are getting together and, and watching it and um, loving it and sending their messages. And then I got this the other day. Oh, All right. Oh, so this okay. is Paul. All right. Doll. Doll. How do you say this? Let's way? see. Do Doll, doll, doll guy? Dollar guy? Dollar guy? Dollar guy? Dollar guy. Dollar guy. There you are. You can see yourself on there. So I'm on the. I'm about to depart. Right, and then wheelchairs come, so I've got to put them of on. Of course, yes, yes, yes. So I get out there, and I'm going to see him with the blues cap. <laughs> okay, go blues, you know, like we're doing all right. This was on the Thursday, yeah, yeah, so yeah, we're yeah. going to be playing that night. You know, go blues, you know. And he looks at me, and he's looking, and he, look, he, he's a little bit like uh, uh, disabled, you yeah. know. So yeah, yeah. he's looking at me, and he goes, you're uh he goes, you're, uh, you're Rocco, you know? And I go, yeah, yeah, And he goes, oh, he goes, I love the jumper punch, you know? And <laughs> then, good. like, he wanted a photo, so I took a photo with him, you know? And then, um, and then like, he's, uh, he's telling me how much he loves the show. And he awesome. just, he's just looking at me like he's like, he's just... Well, isn't that what it's about? Like, it's, you know, families, if people are going through tough times or whatever it is. And then when I got him off at the face, next you know? stage, I get out there and I go, thanks, Paul, mate. I hope you enjoyed the ride, you know, and, yeah. and all that. And, he, and then he looks at me and he goes, oh, I love the jumper bunch. He goes, he goes, Paul can't eat the apple. And he started, <laughs> <laughs> he started laughing, you know. That's good. He started really? laughing, yeah, That's yeah. Great. So, uh... Yeah, so it's <laughs> those moments there that really get to me, you know it what is, I mean? Like, yeah. I never really thought that I would have any sort of influence on anyone, and anyone would be happy. As I said, my family doesn't want to listen to me anymore, you know? <laughs> so they're the people that just listen to me. So this rant is more about, like, just thanking everybody. We seriously, seriously appreciate it. And on a Tuesday night, apart, you know, making the show is great. But on the Tuesday night, just watching people watching and the comments yeah. coming Still, up, yeah. and that really, really, really make my night and day. So just great little like, community. A hundred percent, man. I love it. When we are, we're one big happy family, you know. And I love it. 
I love that we're I mean, putting when smiles. We're not happy, that's okay. Ups and when, downs. You know, when people no, no, are and that's it. And even when we really weren't playing well, you know, like, we used to bring a smile to people's faces, which was important, you know. So yeah. that's it. My rant's about thank you to everybody. <laughs> Thanks to everybody, man. It's a thank really, you rant. <laughs> really makes my day, yeah, 100%. And I know it makes your other days too. It does, yeah. It's... I don't know if it's overwhelming, but it's yeah. I think you you go out there trying to you're trying to speak your own truth and what you think. Yeah. And if you speak your mind, people are. It doesn't matter if it's controversial yeah, or not. People it. will be enamoured by it, and that's 100%. that's what's happening. hundred percent. Yeah. People, you know, when I was walking to the game on Thursday after the train ride, and you know, people coming up saying, "Oh, all you know, love the show. You know, great yeah. work. Keep going. Yeah. Hope we win tonight." So. And they're actually like, yeah. I'm telling you, like people, the messages we get about people, how much they look forward to the Tuesday nights now. It's almost <laughs> we look forward to it. Well, like, we we know, definitely like, look forward to it, yeah. but it's almost like that footy show kind of like feel about it, where yeah. you used to wait for a Thursday yeah. night when when footy show first came out, we used to wait like I never missed the show, yeah. you know. Just getting that same sort of feeling. Of course, I'm not saying with a footy show, but Carlton slash it. Carlton slash people looking forward to a show, Tuesday yeah. night. It's yeah. something to look forward yeah. to, you know. So yeah. So it's Great. really good, yeah, yeah. 100%. It's everyone's show. That's this right. is everyone's, everyone's show. show. And yeah. and this is because of everyone. What we're doing yeah. here is because of everyone, yeah. So yeah. any special shout outs you've got? Um any? I've got one. Yeah, I, you can't, go. I think it was I can't remember his name. So the Josh or Jacob, I met him out uh, the other night on Saturday night at a oh. platform one nightclub. Oh. Uh, ah, I think it was one. Josh or Jacob, one of the two, but um shout out to him. I can't I think that's his, one it's one of the two. Uh, but anyway, message the page. Shout out to you. We uh, yep. we had a chat for a little while, and uh, yeah, the uh, the blue baggers are up and about. So uh, if 100%. you do see us, come up, say hello, and uh, yeah, always yeah. happy to be uh, have a beer share. Look, oh, 100%. all the people on uh, Facebook, that message and Instagram. If, look, if I don't respond, it means I'm like yeah. I'm hiatus. I'm he doesn't respond to us. Don't worry about responding to you. Does he doesn't. Does. Does. John O. Smith does. as well. Yeah. John O's been. Uh, been on the inbox too. He's got those photos as well that he keeps sending in, which is fantastic. Oh, like, actually, we'll how much chuck, memorabilia does we'll, he have? We'll chuck some of those photos up. Yeah, how much so memorabilia? We'll it's ridiculous. Oh, he, he would have spent a, a mint on the club, mate. No, no, he's a freak. I think, he, I think a... he paid for the facility. That they're just really oh, up. mate, I'm telling you, I've never seen so, yeah, so much memorabilia. Yeah, no, thanks great. for all so the messages. To him, we yeah. appreciate it, and hopefully, we can keep up this winning streak and roll. No, well, if we listen, the fans are doing their part. We're doing our part. At, at the moment, the players are doing, are doing their, their yeah, part. Exactly, exactly. We're keeping up. All right. uh, we'll keep doing our part. Yeah. We just hope that they keep doing their part. Correct. You know? like, so, Correct. So, yeah, no, nah, so it's been good, man. It's been good. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. What have I got here? Else. What have I got here? Let's uh, finish off the show <laughs> with a little fit. bit of a seizure. We got a little bit of a fit here. There Let's we go. go. <laughs> We're going to do a bit of... Thump. In a rave. In a rave. It's good. All right, guys. That was fantastic. Let's go to Blues for next week, everyone. Let's get to the get MC. Get to the ground. Please. Get there. Let's Minimum have a drink in the Legends thousand. Lounge as well. Yeah, 100%. I'll be down there in the Legends 60, Lounge having a coffee. 60,000 and get those pieces. Oh, and um, um, I think Mark it. Murphy and Simpson are doing... No, uh, Eddie Betts. Eddie Betts, sorry. Eddie Betts, they're doing. doing so lap get there, of honour. Yep. Get there at 12.45 for their lap of honour. 12.45, yep. Yeah, yep. and we get the Blues. So, so all together now... Go, go Blues! He doesn't want to move. Now... The little lion cubs, they start messing with him. Biting his tail, biting his ears. He doesn't do anything. The lioness, she starts messing with him. Coming over, making trouble. Still, nothing. Now, the other animals, they notice this. And they start to move in. The jackals. Hyenas. The barking at him, laughing at him. They nip his toes and eat the food that's in his domain. They do this and they get closer and closer and bolder and bolder till one day that lion gets up and tears the shit out of everybody, runs like the wind, eats everything in his path. Because every once in a while, the lion has to show the jackals who he is.